uh, for Generation One is I had the music up, not the instrument. I had the music up. Oh, just so I could hear like the music in like each of the dungeons and stuff. All right, hold on. Before we go into what <laughs> she's falling. Um, what we can do before? Look, I changed my hair. So cute, right? <laughs> I don't like what the hair looks like without the hat, though. Like, look what it looks like without the hat. Ah! Got hide that monstrosity of a bow. Um, it's like Lady Gaga hair, but I like how it looks with a hat. <laughs> Hi, Otto. Good morning. Pokemon games are also labeled by generations. Oh, really? Okay. Gotcha. All right. Let me let me get some daily stuff out of the way real quick. It won't take that long, and then we'll go back and do durations. Oh, somebody. Um, I'm, I'm blanking at the name of the. Per I have it. I have it saved, but. Um, they sent me these chess pieces, and there's like little chess pieces you can put in your homestead, and I was like, that's cool. It gave me ideas of what we could do in the future. Like, maybe we could play checkers. <laughs> I don't know if anybody wants to play checkers. Um, but, or chess, or something. I think that this is literally called chessboard. But, um, I was like, that's kind of cool. We can create our own little events in our in our uh, homestead. Hi, Yawn, good morning. It's a snowy day for me. Get to skip work. Hey, it's a snow day for me too. I don't necessarily get to skip, nor do I want to, but, because I stream, but um, it's a snow day here. It's a snow day here. It was nice waking up and seeing there was so much snow outside. Well, so much snow. Like a centimeter, <laughs> like tiny. Oh, I'm done. Still snow is snow, right? It's nice seeing it. It looks really pretty outside. Oh, I bought a cookie from somebody. Somebody was selling cookies in their little shop, so I bought a cookie. It's a little cookie. All right. Okay, let's see here. Um, 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 um. Oh yeah, I need to go to Pork Cup. Pork Cup. Parkour. 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 Skylight Violet is uh, called Generation 9. Snow day! Is it snowing where y'all are? I got a new outfit last night. I broke again. Wait, can I see it, Orca? I would like to see it. I got a bunny coin. You know, guys, are, have y'all been doing this event? There's like, you get coins so easily. Like, I think I'm already at like 200 again, so I'm gonna buy another, oh God. I'm gonna buy another, I'm gonna buy another pet. Hi, Tyler. The roads aren't cleared. Yeah, ours aren't cleared either. I don't see anybody driving outside. I got two pets now and some stardust dyes. Oh, wait, what's a stardust dye? It's really easy. I mean, you just have to remember to do this every day, but since I don't really have that many like daily activities to do, it's really easy for me to remember. <laughs> hey, look, I'm at 180. I'm almost at another 200. Dang it, I thought I was gonna be at 200 today. Oh wait, maybe I will. I have to finish this quest to do my daily fishing. Also, how do I get more of this gourmet bait pen? I got it a while ago. I don't know how I get it. Should I not be using gourmet bait? Oh, Orca. Oh. Ooh, you look cool. I like your jean jacket and your, your holy pants. It looks good. Did you dye your, did you dye your staff? Are you gonna dye your hat black? I fell, ripped my pants. <laughs> oh, Wolf 
Walter! Oh, Walter sells it. Okay. Maybe I should go buy some from Walter instead of using this. Because I'm assuming this is like fancy stuff. Oh, did I just... <laughs> Oops, sorry. I didn't mean to... I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> ah! I crop dusted you. Alright. I'll be right back at work. <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna get into a fashion ogi. Oh my god. You don't wanna you don't wanna be in the conversation that Orca and I had yesterday. <laughs> we were all talking about this okay, I'll show you guys the outfit I really wanna get. It's called the at Orca, what is it called again? It's like a cute little simple dress, but I really, really like it. But it was like on the auction house for 25 mil, which it's a lot for me because if I were to buy buy it, I don't have any more money. And I kind of like saving money so that I can use it for like events. <laughs> but I was like, dang it. I was kind of hoping to buy it for a little bit cheaper. Uh, where's the bait? 10. Um, maybe cooking, event. Mm. How do I get bait? Am I just not seeing it? Wait, what? That's it, art! Yeah, premium newbie, premium summer newbie wear, premium. Summer newbie wear. Yeah, wait, I think I actually had it in my thing. There it is. Premium summer newbie wear. <laughs> summer newbie. And I feel like it fits because I'm a newbie. I don't feel like a newbie anymore though, but I thought it was so cute. The clothes and hair I want are both over 300 million. That's a lot, Tyler. <laughs> That's a nice one. It's one of the oldest outfits, yet still so cute. It's one of the oldest outfits? Oh, I just wanted- I liked it because it just looked really cute. Um, but is it still being sold for summer- wait, pre, wait, hold on, premium summer newbie wear? Is this one it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one. I could buy it, but then I will only have 7k. <laughs> so I was like, mm, maybe I should wait. I don't know. I was trying. Uh, I had somebody told me to just go in the channel one and have like a, a party up. So I did that. It took me a while to figure out how to like do that because you have to set it to dungeon apparently. Confused me. No, Walter here has no bait. Oh, it's tear. Tear has me. Oh, tear. Tear, tear, tear. Tear. Okay. Tear. Got it. Thanks, Orca. Mmm. 2008? That's a long time ago. Yeah, if you guys see uh, the outfit being sold for like cheaper than 25 mil, I'd appreciate it. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. I would probably buy it for 25 mil if I had like more. But I'm just, I wanted to keep some money if I have like a guild event or like an event. <laughs> Alright. I still haven't figured out the best way to make money in the game. There's like so many different ways to do it, but none of it's like, it's all hard. <laughs> All right, here. Ah, this this guy, Malcolm. Malcolm's my man. Thanks, Malcolm. Thanks, Mr. Malcolm. All right, I'm gonna put. This is like my fishing pet, or my random pet. It has a whole bunch of random stuff on him. All right, let me go back to poor Cobb. The music in there is kind of cute, and I like the music here. It used to come with premium character cards back in the day. You would use these unique cards to rebirth and get the outfit boxes with it. Huh. But you don't do that? That's not done anymore? Or... So like, wait, hold on. 
Hold on, let me do this first. Wait, I have a fishing chair. Oh, I guess it's fine. Um, it, so, okay, so you would get a premium character card and then use that to make a character and then when you did that, it came with like a bonus. Okay. Oh, now it's just got gotcha pods. Oh. Interesting, like, so the early days of gacha. <laughs> Someone probably has a bunch of them stashed away. I'll tell you if I see any. Thanks! Thanks, Tyler! Appreciate it. Run content, sell drops. Yeah, that's, that's kind of been, like, my uh, go-to, but I haven't been, like, focusing on doing that content like I should be. I get so distracted and I want to just do every, I just want to do everything in the game. <laughs> oh, good to know I ran out of bait. Yeah, go to Malcolm at Tier and buy, buy that bait. You used to have to buy a rebirth card to rebirth. Uh, oh, like a character card? How much were they? Hi, Red Guppy! Good morning! You haven't unlocked the content that is really worth farming. For instance, that Abyssal Orb is from Advanced Elite Tech Missions. Right. Yeah, that would be really nice to, to get. <laughs> Um, when do I unlock those? Is it a generation? Remind me, I can't remember. Generation 22 and 23? Okay, I have a while to go. <laughs> I got a while to go, but that's okay. $10? So to rebirth, you had to spend $10? Oh, that sucks. That's expensive. I would just never rebirth. <laughs> I would just never rebirth. I'd be like, I'll just stay at level 72 forever. Then you wouldn't get anywhere. Um, I don't have to work today. Yay! Do you have a snow day too, Red Guppy? G22, that's so far away, darn it. And it's gonna take me longer because I'm gonna read it. What have I done to myself? Can I unlock it without generation? <laughs> you know how I can like go to Avon without it? Um, if you guys take me, can I just go to tech dungeons without that? It's probably not good to do though. There's Elite Shadow Wizard runs and Tail. Oh, that was the second time I heard that. Elite Shadow Mission runs and Tail Shadow Missions, which is good early content. Ah, okay, I'll do that. I'll focus on that. That's the second time I heard that. I'm gonna write that down. Ways to make money. Do y'all have any other? Wait, you probably don't want to tell me. <laughs> Never mind. Ways to make money. I gotta fund my my fashionogi fund. So elite shadow wizard runs. Okay, I think y'all said on Friday. Friday, because that's when you get the passes, and then tech. Tech missions, tech missions, advance, elite, but that's not until G23, or G22 to 23. Why do y'all say G22-23? Is it in the middle between 22 and 23? Oh, fine leathers. Yeah, that is a good idea too. But I want to keep those, so I want to work on tailoring. 
You gotta wait to rebirth. I think you have to wait until you're age 20 to rebirth. Oh, and then, then you had to pay, pay for the card. Oh, you're all for MLK Day. Gotcha. Hi, Edwarded. Oh my god, 20 stream streak. Hello. <laughs> Thank you. No, oh, no for that. Okay, but Crom you can. I watched you do Crom dreams. That looked cool. There was a lot to take in, I'm not gonna lie. When I was watching you, I was like, trying to keep up. <laughs> You were like, that was the one where you had to like go left and then, no, I don't know, you had to like know where you needed to go. It confused the heck out of me. I punch logs and reforge them to 3L to sell. I don't know what that means. <laughs> you punch logs? <laughs> Why do you punch logs? Doesn't that hurt your hand? <laughs> I still don't know how to make money. By the way, I'm broke. It's okay, Tyler. It's all good. Don't tailor with fine leathers. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Do I wanna do a do I wanna do a crumb? Uh can I? <laughs> Didn't y'all say that was like in-game content? When I like die the minute I just step in the, the dungeon, they're like, they just, a lightning bolt appears. They're like, you're too low level. Also, did I fish 10 yet? Oh, one more. Grocery store part-time job for raw chicken. 340, 340K? Wait, what? I need to understand part-time jobs more. I feel like I haven't really looked that up yet. I mean, I have, but I haven't. I did Tara bank part-time job. That's fun. Oh, look! Orca found my favorite metal die amp. He found it. If you guys ever see these metal di this metal die amp, let me know, because it's like the exact pink that I like. <laughs> like the hex code or whatever. So go away. So good. Goy goy soo. Okay. Let me put this up. Um, yeah, look. It's so clean now. There used to be like so many things in here. Now there's just one. <laughs> look at that. I'm almost done. Almost. I'll look up the grocery store part-time job. Grocery store? I guess just the way of making money is if you're high level, then you can do like some of the cool content and then that has like some cool gear that can drop. Or you can like do random bits and bobs everywhere. I have to afford my, my, I had to afford getting a dress. I have to afford getting a dress. Okay. All right, I need to focus on generation one today. So everything after generation one, I'll have to figure out what I'll do. So maybe I will do Krom, we'll see. I'm, unless you want, I don't know if you'll, uh, you'll be on when I'm finished, but I think I'm kind of close to being done with generation one. Let's see. Or I'm on nine, whatever that means. What do I have to do? I forgot where I left off. I need to do like a little recap for those that may have missed it. Where am I? This, this is it. Duncan's call. All right, so a little recap to people um, that have not done generation one <laughs> or don't know anything about Mabinogi. Um, so it all started with us meeting this guy named Tarlock. Tar Tarlock, I think. Anyways, he's a bear during the day, but he's a human at night. And then you talk to him, you're like, what the heck's happened? Um, long story short, he and his two other friends, Mari and Rari, um, they went to go save the goddess named Mor Morgan. She's like this beautiful goddess with like black hair, 
sexy body. She's gorgeous, right? And he wanted to help her, but it turns out she was evil. But hold on. She was evil and she wanted to, because there's like these monsters in this world called formers. Ooh. Here, look at this while I'm explaining. Ah. Um, formers are like the monsters in the world. And she basically wanted to um, curse humans because she's the goddess of revenge. And basically send like this giant army to attack all of the humans in the world. However, we learned that that wasn't Morgan. It wasn't her. It's some some person impersonating her. I don't know who it is though. I haven't figured out who the heck that is, but we learned recently that it's not her. So, yeah. Spoilers. Hey, I told you I was gonna do a recap. She wouldn't let me leave channel one until I found it. No, that's not true, Orca. Shut up. That would be awesome though, Dreams. I would love to go with you. Oh no, is it locked behind a quest line? Uh oh. Anyways, that's a very, very TLDR of generation one so far. <laughs> There's obviously more stuff that's happened, but we're basically just trying to go and save the goddess at Tirnanog, which is kind of like, they call it like the heaven of the, I don't, I don't know, the heaven world, like it's just heaven, I guess. Human heaven. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> Poor <God. laughs> You kill me! Okay. Alright, I have to continue though, let's see. We we recently did a role-playing dungeon, which are so fun. I hope we can keep doing them. So now I have to go meet Chief Duncan. Alright, let's continue. Hi! What is streamer napping? I have to I have to focus on generation one right now. Um, dreams I can't do it right now. Sorry. Unless this is for something else. Okay. Thank you. I really wanted to finish Generation 1 today. I can't believe you ruined G1 for me. I ran through it four times now. It's the second, it's the sexy giant dream. Oh, dreams? <laughs> You've, how have you run it four times? Do you just, do you just really like the story and that's why you did it four times? Or do you have like four other characters that you did it on? Oh, you can replay it? Oh, alt? Oh, that would make sense. Oh! That's my bad, Orca. <laughs> Alright, Duncan. Alright. Is this true? Is that really the memory that was held within Sheila's memento? The goddess was white-winged and wearing a mask? Oh, <gasps> that's the traitor! That's the guy impersonating Morgan! Kind of looks like a Diablo character. There's no doubt it was, oh, Chicho! Oh, that's Chicho. Chicho! I had my suspicions when I heard about the ghost armor in Dark Knight, and I never really thought he could still be alive. Chicho is one of the former gods. He is the instigator of all evil. Well, that would make a lot of sense. It's Chicho. Chicho? I like Chicho better. Um, he also brought glass glubahybin into this world to destroy our ancestors. He brought Krom. Oh, is that Krom? Is that the Krom that y'all were talking about? Krom Crotch to Wrath. He cost the goddess her life in Aaron. Oh, the goddess used to live in Aaron? Interesting. Uh, yes, yes, this explains everything. Here's my theory. When the goddess was creating barriers in the dungeons, Chicho petrified her and took her to Tirnanog under his rule. Then he pretended to be the goddess to rally the forces of evil and tricked Moors into aiding his cause. That definitely is it. Moors is kind of like the the mentor of Tarlock. 
So he was so shocked to hear when Morris was on the, the evil side. But he was tricked! Crom crotch plotline. Yes. <laughs> Ah, oh, clever. That uh, also explains why Morgan now calls upon you. She desperately needs your help. Hurry! You must find a way to Tirnanog and save the goddess! On my way! So y'all do Crom Crotch... Crom Crotch Dungeons? Is that what it is? Ahem. Okay, let's see here. Okay, two Tarlock. Tarlock. City. I have to get used to type this stuff again. Going back and forth. Crom Bass. Oh, that's different. Okay. Gotcha. Crom might be a title. Maybe it's like, you know how Mr. and Mrs. Maybe Crom's like a title or something. That would make sense. Alright, Tarlock. Wait, that wasn't the real Morgan? White winged with her face covered? I can't believe it. I've been deceived. How is it that I never picked up on it? It must be Chichul, the god of the formers. Of that, I have no doubt. I'll never forgive what he's done. He deceived not only my friends, but my master as well. Even the goddess herself wasn't able to escape his grasp. Thank you for bringing this to light. I'm ashamed to have doubted the grace of the goddess, even... No, especially because of my power as a druid. Christelle was right. Morgan really is in danger. Kylie, please, go to Tirnanog. I'm ashamed to have to ask you, but everything is in your hands now. You must rescue the goddess. Oh, I... Oh, I've got this. Help, is there anyone who can hear me? Ooh, the music. Glass Gubahai will soon be revived. A titan, no, not but destruction. Right, the formers are are re revise, reviving this like creepy monster. The adamantine necessary for its resurrection has long been prepared. The sample is almost complete as well. We have precious little time remaining. When life once again courses through the avatar of destruction's veins, Aaron's last day shall have come. Hark hearken to my words. Come and defeat the glass globe and save me from this place. So yeah, this this glass thing is like this giant creepy monster. Oh, that's creepy. What the heck was that? This pendant, the key to the door. Hurry. What was that? <laughs> the heck? Anyways, the glass guy is like this demon that's destroyed humankind before and they're resurrecting him to do it again. So, you know. Pendant of the Goddess. Okay. Meet Chief Duncan. Okay, Duncan. Hi, Hula. Good frozen morning to you, too. It is pretty uh, pretty chilly, isn't it? Thanks, Critical. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, it's not... Uh, it's not anything new, I think. I feel like y'all have, like, certain names for things, too, don't you? I just... I started with Final Fantasy XIV. It's not gonna end with Mabinogi, <laughs> that's for sure. Also, I need to go use the restroom again. Mm. Will y'all give me uh, a couple minutes? I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick and go get some more water. Feels like everyone abandoned Austin. <laughs> it's okay. So wait, you have snow on the ground too. I have snow and I live in Dallas. It's awesome. Okay, time to save the world. One, one talk to Duncan at a time. <laughs> um... You had a dream about the goddess again, and she told you that the resurrection of Glass Gubaheim is imminent? As I suspected, Moors must be behind the efforts to resurrect a Glass Gubaheim. 
it troubles me that we don't even have a contingency plan for how to deal with such a threat. I may have forgotten to mention this, but the, men the metal adamantine is nearly immune to magical energies. So you can imagine that creates its own raft of issues when fused with magical creatures or constructs. That is why, for this pu purpose, special spe specimens are required. The souls of humans who have exhibited great courage. It's even possible that, thanks to the three missing warriors' visit there, the souls have already been made ready. If their preparations are, are that far along, then we desperately need to figure out how to stop it. Hurry and find a way there. Where? Hi, Jai, good morning. I love how I constantly try to open Blanid's thing, but it's not. Okay, we have to go to Kerstel at Dunbarton. Kerstel and Tarlock's love thing was still confuses me. <laughs> Me. I love the tree. I'm gonna be sad when the tree's gone. Okay. <clears throat> if if Tiernanog truly is the land of the formers, I suppose it doesn't hurt to tell you. After all, I have already betrayed the formers. The land of the formers is a dangerous place. You will find no aid there, save for your own self and any willing to make the trek with you. Every step of the journey would tax and torment an ordinary human. Still, I'll tell you the way to the place called Tirnanog that Tarlock spoke of. This former pass is a type used only by high-ranking formers. Take these wings as well to speed you on your way. I pray you keep them both close at hand. All right. So maybe I was wrong about Tirnanog. I'm a little confused by Tirnanog, but I thought Tirnanog was the heaven, but I guess I just read that wrong. Or maybe I'm just misremembering. Um, okay. Let's see. A black form of has ominous energy is made from this. Although it's called a pass, it looks like the talisman that gathers mana. It is said, oh, I can bring up to three people. Orca! Wanna- oh! A warrior pursuing the restoration of Morrigan. She's pretty. <laughs> Wait, what's going on? I bid you have- make haste. Even now, the embers of destruction grow hot beneath Aaron's foundations. Already they have fashioned from the metal of your world great and heavy bones for the Colossus in whose wake the world will shudder once more. Even now the hour draws nigh when it shall be summoned forth. That thing looks terrifying. My body is bound by the powers of the five magic stones. I have not the power to halt the glass of Hyven's resurrection. I need your help. She's bound by five magic stones. So I need to like destroy those stones I guess? If the seal of the other world prevents your passage, then band together with three others with strength akin to yours, and together you shall possess a power greater than any lone warrior. At the head of such a trio, go forth and break the seal that leads to the to the other world. Wait, why is why is this person taller? Wait, isn't that supposed to be Mari? She's short though. Ooh. I entreat you, stop the revival of Glass Gloobahibin. Destroy the five magic stones that bind me. The time is short, it's coming is imminent. So dramatic, I love it. Please, hurry. It's like Princess Zelda. Nice hand rest. <laughs> Oh, I guess that was just a cutscene. Oops. Wait, did I go in? No, I'm not in yet. Okay. I got confused there. So I was like, I still have the pass. Um, I guess that cutscene happens when you just get to the dungeon. 
Uh, Orca, do you want to do um this role playing mission with me? We are. Where am I? Uh, which dungeon is this? Hold on. Is F in here? Oh, I'm in Barry Barry Dungeon. Okay, thank you. I'm in Barry Dungeon. Is that Finn awake? Evan, come do a roleplay mission with me. Roleplay dungeon. Oh, you bastard, do you want to come? Oh, Finn might be asleep. <laughs> oh, it's not roleplay? Oh, it's not? Oh, I guess that would make sense. Good morning. I think it's only three people, though. Hold on, let me double check. Up to three people can enter Bari Dungeon. Alright. Uh, Yavesu, can I... I'll ask nicely. Please don't kill everything, like, super fast. Um, there aren't any more RP dungeons in this gen. Oh, <gasps> no! Never mind. It's not RP. Oops, RP. Safe late killing monsters. <laughs> All right, you ready? Let's do this. Let's save the world. Drop. Ready, steady. So it's probably just a regular Bari dungeon, isn't it? Whoa. Oh, it's probably just regular. <laughs> I can still roleplay? Um, Orca, you're better at roleplaying than me. We're, we're heading... It's up to us to take this dungeon. To make this dungeon special. <laughs> <laughs> it's up to us to save the goddess. There we go. I ain't gonna mess with those mimics. We have to go and fight the... Get the seals. What was it? Five seals? I'm guessing they're in this dungeon. We have to destroy them. I'm so immersed. <laughs> <sighs> Are there any roleplay dungeons in Generation 2? Or Generation 5? Also, Yvesu, you can fight normally. I think it's okay. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a role-playing dungeon. But I, even if it was a role-playing dungeon, then it wouldn't have... You wouldn't be able to, to use your skills anyways. Goodbye, you fiend! That was fast. <gasps> Whoa! This was only the beginning! Now we have to go through this really creepy door. Through another world. Wait. What? Won't our faces get melted if we open? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> also, I didn't bring anything to cut the chains. Um, I did. Don't worry, apparently. Oh, I got the breaker of the other world. <laughs> if non-leader... Oh, oh, okay. That's why I had to... Oh! Oh! <gasps> Whoa! This is trippy. Cool, so this is how you get to the other world. This is how you get to Tirnanog. Oh, there's a big hole. Wait, what? We're in tier? Oh, but it's like a parallel universe tier. Oh, so this is like where the formers live. Wow, they have a giant hole here. Did we make that hole? I'm assuming... 
Maybe. Didn't they say something about... Maybe no, no, maybe. Maybe not. Oh my god, is this Duncan? Oh my god, this is Duncan, Duncan's evil brother, Dougal. He looks the same! Wait, he looks younger. Oh, interesting. You're quite brave to come to a place like this. I'm Dougal. I'm here, alone. You are not from around here, are you? I am Dougal, the last human left here. It's been a while since I've seen anyone. It gets rather lonely sometimes. You're wondering why I keep this lonely vigil? Well, it is complicated, but let us say I am not here by choice. Ah, so you're curious if this is Tirnanog, as in the Paradise of Legend? Ha! Huh, I didn't expect such a naive question. Surely you have eyes, do you not? If this, is, if this truly was a paradise where sickness and death held no sway, do you think my legs would be as you see it? What's wrong with your legs? Oh, it's because he has a cane? Look at the town around you. It was destroyed in a former raid. That should answer your question. I don't know what manner of rumors you've heard, stranger, but I can tell you plainly, this is not the land you seek. It is merely another world claimed by the formers. Still, if you're curious, Feel free to look around as much as you like. Even here, you may find echoes of some familiar time or place. Ha <laughs> ha. As one who is not native to this world, I suspect that if you were to lose control of your body here, you would find the experience more than a little troublesome. Indeed, apart from your party, none can lead you any direct aid, lend you any direct aid here. Even if you fall, the flame of your life depleted, Without the aid of some special object to bind your soul. <laughs> Just dancing in the background. You will return to your own world if defeated. It's only natural as an existence foreign to this domain. Hmm, do you know anything about the soul tethering phenomena? It refers to the propensity of a displaced soul to remain close to its physical body because it cannot fully leave that of which it was once a part. It occurred to me that I might be able to make use of this very phenomena to help fix your soul to this world, at least for a time. If your soul does not depart, but instead lingers near your fallen body, you will not have to revive in, in back revive in back in your own world and repeat whatever arduous sequence of events brought you hence. However, dealing with souls is not exactly a simple matter. Just the opposite. In fact, an undertaking fraught with danger, if, any, if something goes even slightly amiss, you might end up not unlike those zombies shuffling around the graveyard. Jeez. That is why I'd like to ask something of you first, to see if my speculation has any merit. Zombies are, by their nature, soulless beings, so if you defeat them, I should be able to gauge the force of the soul-tethering phenomenon they exhibit. Then I'll know whether you would be able to revive here. Interesting, okay. How does that sound? Would you care to give it a try? Yes. How do I do that? Oh, I can buy stuff from him. Should I buy more? I'm gonna buy some more Phoenix feathers just in case. Okay. Well, gosh dang, that was a lot about reviving. All right, what do we do here? Oh, the music here is different. Defeat one zombie in the graveyard. We have to head to the graveyard. Oh, it's this way. Also, it's the walking dead. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here's one zombie. Oh, well. A windmill? Oh, okay. Uh, hold on. Let me get my windmill. Hold, hold that thought, Mr. Zombie. <laughs> At least they're slow. <laughs> oh, there we go. Nice. Okay, did it. Killed that poor female zombie. Is this the first? <laughs> <laughs> Just as I suspected, I can make use of the soul tethering phenomenon to help your soul. 
Remain in this place. If you place your trust in me, I promise you will not join the ranks of the undead, even should you fall here. That is due to my body and mind commuting with you with uh, enough strength to anchor you here temporarily, allowing you to revive in this world. Heh, <laughs> I can't say you look entirely comfortable with the idea. You needn't hide your discomfort. It is not ex unexpected. Still, you can now return here if you, ev if you are ever incapacitated. Keep that in mind and you will be able to explore this world with a bit more gusto. Okay. Got it. Why did I get a gem? Find, use the small green gem to collect a black orb at Owl B Dungeon. Whoa, it's spelt differently. Oh, I love how it's all just deserted house, deserted house, and then house. <laughs> Do they have like, are the people that are, oh look, these are, oh, these are dingoes. It's a dingo. I guess you can't go in any of like the grocery shops and see, maybe we could see like Malcolm's evil brother. Falcom. Hi, Prince, hello. All right, we have to go to Albi with an E dungeon. <laughs> this is cool. So Tirden Nog is just a parallel universe. Sort of. Find the black orb. All right. Oh, I guess the green gem is like what you drop. Cool, here you go. All right, let's do this. This is pretty. Their dungeons look fancier than ours. Yeah, I want their world. They just need, they just need a bit of fertilizer for the grass. You know, that's all they need. <laughs> a little fertilizer get the grass coming up no big deal they they gotta get some turf oh, yeah maybe just turf they don't have to worry about it <laughs> is this australia no <laughs> hi i'm doing good we're doing we're doing some story today just a little bit i don't plan to do it all day um, and then, what else? Oh, there's snow on the ground, so that's cool. I woke up to snow. So it feels, like, comfy. Oh, wow, that was so short. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Ooh, gargoyles. Ooh, the sound that they make. Book of Thunder, Chapter 5. I'm gonna take that. We're just that good. It flew through that. Yes. Why are you sitting? <laughs> we did it. Is this the black orb? Oh, there it is. Here, I think we need to get our chest first. You wanted to have a chat with them? Oh, okay. Ah, the black orb. This is one of the orbs binding Morgan. Oh, wait, maybe... What do I do? Do I keep kicking it? Oh, there it is. You broke the seal and received the black orb fragment. It took you six times to do this quest because you couldn't find the orb. <laughs> it's right there. Oh, wait, I didn't take it. <laughs> How did you not see it? Oh, there it is. The black orb. All right, we got to do that four more times, I think. I'm guessing. Is that now do we have to go back to Dougal? Oh, use... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Now we have to use the black orb. Oh, so now... Oh, okay, I see. So now we have to use this. Oh, okay, and it leads us to the other orbs. Got it. Hi, stars! What platform is this on? It's PC. Is there a referral code? Oh, no, it's just a free-to-play MMO. Anybody can play. It's on, um, you can either download it on Steam, or 
you can, um, yeah, hold on, let me turn this down just a little bit. You can download on Steam or you can play from the Nexon launcher. I'm using the Nexon launcher to play. But that's just, just because I chose that. Welcome back, Colo. You used to have to run four multi-floor dungeons that you created which e with each of the four, or wait, with each of the colored gems to make the black orb. That sounds oh, like a lot. <laughs> Shoot, I'm sorry. The, yeah, there's only one server. Oh man, am I just, hold on. Maybe, hold on, hold on, one second, let me. There we go. Why is my is my pet stuck? Oh god. Hold on, I'm coming. Didn't realize there was wait. I'm going the wrong way. Okay, alright, I'm I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> I got a little turned around. But yeah, there's only one server. There used to be more servers, but they've they've since mer merged them. So we're all playing on the Aaron server. The Aaron server. We would love to have you though, Prince, if you'd like to play. I have a guild if you would like to join. It's called Pixelated. Mm. Best guild. I love how I can know what direction you were trying to go to at Orca every time you type. Because there's always a W or an S in front. <laughs> <laughs> Are you Because the chat doesn't go away after I'm done. No, I've done that too. WASD player. I do W I do WASD too. <laughs> Liz! Good morning! <laughs> I I've noticed that I'll have like random letters here sometimes. <laughs> It's funny. We're saving the world today, guys. From glass glubahibin. You know, I I realized why where I got glubahibin from. It's hemoglobin. I was like, where did I get glubahibin? Hemoglobin. <laughs> That's what it's from. Glass Gutenberg. <laughs> I think this is the only game I use mouse to move. I guess if you hold it down, that works too. I'm, I guess I'm just really, I'm so used to WASD. Your hand is stuck to the F keys. Oh, to like use your skills. Oh, a mix of both. Downstairs, here we go. The boss floor is here, as well as another orb. I like that we're taking our time though. Ooh, skeletons. Is there any like cool stuff you can get um, here? Or are you attacking by dance? Interpretive dance? <laughs> Keep it up, Orca. I love it. What's with these faces that are appearing? <laughs> Ratman, gross. Get out of here, Ratman. How do we? How do I know? Y'all said holding Alt or something. How do I know which one has the key? Skill issue. <laughs> Ooh, red skeleton. Oh, goodbye, red skeletons. Oh, and werewolf. 
It's Jacob. Jacob Black. Wait, what did you say? Sometimes if you load faster, only the right chest will spawn. Oh. Book. Book of Fireball, page six. I'm collecting all the pages. I got a Thunder page and I got a Fireball page. What is this? Oh, no, no. All right, 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 right. There's probably nothing good in that anyways. Do you have an object targeting key set? No, I don't. I need to do the, I need to look at my hotkeys. At least I don't think I do. I don't remember doing, I don't, I think the only thing I remember setting up in my hotkeys is to open up my pet inventory. Lana gives you three int skills after G3, so you don't need to collect the pages. Oh! Oh, I was just being silly and getting the pages. <laughs> I sold one for 50k the other day. So I thought, oh, maybe they're worth something. <laughs> but, oh, so they're for skills. That would make sense. So what you use to play PC? Yeah, I'm playing on my PC. <laughs> Kill the gargoyle! Oh, nice. All right, boss time. Ooh, ghosts. Ghost armors. Hey, these guys were in that beginner cuts, beginning cutscene. Hello. He ignored you. <laughs> Why are you running? <laughs> now he's just defending. Love me. <laughs> Sorry, Orca. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> Whoa, this is cool. Thank you. Your will and courage have won my freedom after these many years. Wait, did I already get all of the seals? Or the... Wasn't there like four orbs? I'm confused. Oh no, oh, hold on. There's an ad playing. I'll wait. That's how you do it. Later when you have time, scroll through your hotkey settings and set one. This will make what people were saying about the chess. Oh, okay, got it. So what is it called? Object targeting key set. Okay, hold on. Let me write that down. Object targeting equals got it got it four orb is older they revamped G g1 so i guess they like just skipped you ahead i mean i don't i don't mind i was expecting to do that dungeon four different times which i'm assuming is that what y'all said y'all had to do or no y'all said you had to you had to do a four multi-floor dungeon that you created with each of the colored gems to make the black orb. Oh, but they gave me the black orb. Oh, got it. Got it. So how did you get the gems before? Like the red, green, blah, blah, blah. How did you get those before? You just had to run through the gym and like, or run through the dungeon and get the gems and then you combine? Oh, you got it from the mobs of the world. Oh, okay. Got it. All right, ads are done, so we're good. Okay, thank you. Your will and courage have won my freedom after these many years. I would gladly see your efforts repaid, but it seems now is not an opportune time. The, re the revival of the Avatar of Destruction approaches. Glass Gubahibe, one of the titans of legend. Glass Gubahibe are fiends that leave ruination in their wake. Long ago, were they deprived of their very souls, their wills bound. Their hulking bodies were, an empty ves were as empty vessels, imbued with the summoner's desire that all be laid waste. 
that Aaron and Tirnanog alike should be raised without mercy. Find the soul torn from this glass cube of hyphen. He was settled in this land, clad in a human body? Take my pendant to him. The soul torn from him? He used to be a human? Go and tell him that his true body, the body of glass Glubahimen, will soon be revived. Then he will surely help you. I cannot presently aid you, but I shall grant your blessings in my name. The blessing of the goddess Morgan. I thank you for your help. She's not going to come with? What the heck? What? Oh, hi, kitty. Oh, there we go. Just needed a load. All right, um, <laughs> Kitty's like celebrating, so cute. Cheer squad! <laughs> All right, we have to visit, visit Dougal. All right, y'all can chill real quick. I'm gonna go talk to Dougal. Let me go talk to some Dougal. Mr. Dougal. Wait, is Mr. Dougal the body of glass glue? Wait, is, he what? Wait, is he glass glue behind him? So this is his soul? I'm just assuming. We'll see. Hi, Giga. How are you doing today? Congrats on hitting affiliate. Woo, that's exciting. Makes today even more special. You should sell silver for a lot since it was the rare one. Oh, you could sell silver. Oh, just did you need silver to make the black orb? All right, here we go. Dougal. Oh, God. Here we go. The sky, all of the sudden, something changed. I suppose that means you saved the goddess. Excellent work. You tell Dougal what the goddess told you. The goddess said that? But why tell me? Ah, I see. Heh, <laughs> ha ha. That answers many questions I've, I have long, long had. The soul tethering phenomena that I used before to anchor you more fully to this world was acting upon myself as well. Though it appears you've realized it already, did you come to tell me because you already know? Indeed, I am a soul who hails from another world just as you are. My true self is known among you as one of the glass glubahibans. He's a glass glubahiban, chat. I came to this world to retrieve my body, which was summoned here against my will by the humans who dwell here. Alas, I wound up in this sorry state, bound to the last human left here. Oh. Frailties and all, getting around with this leg has been no doubt, or no end of trouble. With the knowledge you've brought me, I felt, or I feel I ought to make good on my original intention. The goddess likely realized I would, and so she sent you to me. My purpose now is to win the freedom of my true body and send it back to my home world by severing the present bonds that hold it here. The pendant of the goddess is a key that allows one to pierce the veil between worlds. If you would like, I can engrave a pattern that should guide you toward my body. It has been calling to me. Still, I am certain, uh, oh, uncertain, whether I can place my trust in you as you are. Under the command of the summoner, my body would likely be able to destroy a human as easily. Are you truly certain you can defeat my body and return to, turn it to where it came from? So I guess he's just like a ghosty boy. Very well, then I shall place my trust in you. As one who was able to save the goddess, it may be worth a try. Offer up the engraved pendant on the altar of the Alvi dungeon. I'm sure you need no guidance on using the red wings of the goddess to get there. Should you succeed, it will then be but a matter of time before the effects of the soul tethering phenomena ebb, and the forces binding me to this place are no more. Oh man, dang, let's help this poor guy out, man. Hi, Dima. Okay. I'm gonna use my wing. Oh wow, I can teleport the whole party here too. What? Cool. Oh, there's a penguin robe. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, that's cute. That's so cute. I didn't know there were penguin robes in the game. All right. Go team. Thank you. We're off. Okay. 
Did I, did I drop it? Wait, this is the right, this is what I have to drop, right? Oh, it's called the final dance. Offer the pendant to of the goddess by to Alvi Dungeon and stop glass glue behind it. Guys, we gotta stop that crazy demon guy. All right, it's just his body. His soul is in Tirnanog. Dougal. Here we go. I do have the music on. Can y'all hear it? Is it too low? Should I make it higher? Oh! Wait, is he not getting a trial? What do you mean? Shared how to set the object targeting key to your Discord in case other memory. Oh, thank you, Liz! This is such a throwback. Vampire bag! This track is so good. I love the walls of this dungeon. I know, right? It's so pretty. <laughs> it's so decorated. The way I run with a staff. <laughs> Me. Goodness. Ah, more dungeons we have to spam should be this fancy. I agree. The beat does go hard. <laughs> We're almost at the boss. We're almost at Glass Blue Behind. Oh wow, that was literally just a key to the door. All right, y'all ready? Y'all ready? What is this? Oh, goddess pass. I don't know, but I took it. Let's go. <gasps> Look at Orca. <laughs> Ew. You are fortunate to have made it this far, but your journey ends here. It's the Dark Lord. None shall hinder the revival of glass food behind me. May the blessing of the goddess Morgan be upon me. Take this! I'd like to see you try, punk! Attack! Oh, he dropped a white truffle. <laughs> oh, there's a mouse. Not bad. Not bad. You died. Oh god, what is with all the mice? The time we have long awaited is upon us at last. We shall see the end of Aaron. I shall grant you one final mercy. You will have the honor of being the first to fall before the might of the revived glass goodbye. Die here, interloper. Pay the penance for your transgressions. What are all these hooks, man? It's scary. <laughs> Am I gonna one hit the, the boss? <gasps> She's here! Oh wait, no, it's the fake one. You arrived earlier than I had anticipated. I must command you for that. Alas, the glass glue behind me has already been revived. Ah ha 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 ha! Don't be too disappointed. You are perhaps uniquely qualified to serve as a test of the resurrected Titan's power. Indeed, the blood of spirited adventurers just like yourself were quite helpful in speeding the resurrection process. Now, there is nothing that can stop the human realm from burning to cinders. No! that sound you get makes. Ew. Ew, this one I'm giving me nightmares. <laughs> oh. Well then. Oh, you're quite tall. Oh god. Fight! Fight him! Fight! Ooh, 
the sound he makes. Oh my god, he does windmill. <laughs> he has sticky breath. He does. Oh! Ha ha ha! Take that! <laughs> so strong. I was kind of surprised they didn't make him a little bit tankier, but it's fair. It's generation one after all. Oh my, you actually managed to defeat the glass glue behind him? Truly, you have exceeded my expectations. Run, she's not the real goddess, she's a fake. Ah, oh, did you just now figure it out, Moors? I suppose the dullness of human wit that lends far too much credence to a thing's appearance holds true even for a great wizard. How disappointing. You obviously harbored misgivings enough to give the glass Kuhaimo in a weakened state. Oh, it was already weak? But then how is it you took this long to voice your doubts about my identity? Chicho, you snake! I would feel your pr foul presence behind this. How dare you impersonate the goddess? I had a hunch, but when you ordered me to kill Tarlock and Mari, it was then that suspicion became certainty. Heh, <laughs> if you truly realized it then, you should have acted. It's too late for you now. Is it? Your scheme has failed, Chicho. The glass blew behind him and has, fa has fallen. Give yourself up and beg for mercy. So that's why it was weak, because it was already weak. Ha ha ha, you are telling me to beg for mercy? I see you at least retain a sense of humor. Do you really think a god would have any need to beg clemency of mortals? Or might it be that in defeating the glass glue behind me, you believe you've thwarted my plans in their entirety? Come now, surely you, your vaunted wisdom must at least esteem me more and more canny than that. Your bluffs can't faze me, cre cretin. You deserve to be wiped from the face of this world. Ha! You think this is a feint? You are pathetic as you are foolish. This was but the beginning, a single branch of the tree. You know even better than I what happens when a glass glue behind him falls, yes? Oh, it can't be! <gasps> What's gonna happen? Oh no! It's an atomic bomb! Whoa! Wait, did it really just, what? The destruction of Urg. Hey, Urg. Leading to the linking of the two worlds, now I see. Was that, was this your plan all along, Tito? What? So because it died, it linked the two worlds? All along, of course, all roads were to lead to this. You used me. None of this would have been possible without the glass group behind me I labored to revive. I may be almost as culpable as you, but for that sin, I'm willing to atone, even if it should cost my life. I'll bring the curtain down on everything, including you. It's truly pitiable to see you casting about, wizard, but do not think to drag me into it. Your sins are your own to suffer. But what you call sin, I call deliverance. This land must be cleansed of the plague of mankind, and I would be glad to start with you, along with those accursed interlopers. Me? Is that a challenge, Chicho? I may not be as spry as I once was, but I have devoted my life to the practice of wizardry. A god you may be, but I warn you, you underestimate, underestimate me at your peril. Oh, well, here we go. The rock beginner, bringer of destruction, sour of chaos, descend. Oh. I'm like this colorful, cheerful person. Oh, you can't see me. <laughs> ah! Leave this place now! You can't beat him as you are! Uh-oh. He's after me now. No! <gasps> oh, goodness. Did he just sacrifice himself to save me? Why didn't he put himself in the barrier? Uh-oh. Moors, no! Was that all you could muster, Moors? Magic is woven of mana, and mana is born of the gods. No matter the greatness a mortal being might achieve, theirs will ever be but a pale imitation of the absolute. Tch. 
So frail he lacked even the strength to kill himself alive. As with him, so it goes with all humans. Gosh dang! And now only you remain. Oh, I'm struggling. Are you afraid? Fear will not avail you. You can but curse your destiny, mortal, born of the dust, doomed to perish. You can but curse your destiny, born of the dust, doomed to perish. You just said that. Oh, God. Uh oh, he's, he's talking. He's using his crazy words. Uh oh. In the name of the goddess, I command you to stop. Oh, Morgan, she's here. Flashback. Oh, if it isn't Morgan, that whelp must have been busier than I expected. I didn't expect, or, yeah, I didn't expect one so frail to actually free the goddess. You have clad yourself in my image and thrown the world of man into disarray. As a goddess of vengeance, I have come to collect my price for your offenses. Ha ha ha! I neither showed nor spoke any falsehood. I merely borrowed your form to make the truth easier for the wretched mortals to grasp. You have seen how they cling so tightly to their hatred, fighting and killing each other. Where is the lie? The misery that lies upon mankind is that which they heap upon themselves. You are the inheritor of Belor's will, chosen to lead the formers. Why must you so abhor the world of man? After two great wars, do you truly still yearn to see more blood spilt? Such conflict with claim will claim the lives of your enemies. Yes, but does it not also cost the lives of countless formers? You seem to misunderstand, Morgan. The annihilation of mankind is the necessary first step towards the creation of a true paradise. The blood of the formers is valuable only insofar as it can further that cause. The Lord disregard that truth, which proved his downfall in the end. I, however, am different. I understand that the laws that govern this world can only be brought to perfection once mankind has been eradicated. You can't expect me to believe you're wholly unaware, Morgan. As a god, you should already know the will of the supreme god that gives us life. What is the name of the Supreme God? Oh, this is a lot of talking. <clears throat> it's been like three years ago when you did it, and it, oh, it was a lot easier. <laughs> it's just power creep. Yeah, I feel, I'm level like 5,000 or 6,000, so I feel like that's a good reason. Hi, thanks, sir. I am. I'm in, I'm doing generation one today. He be spitting facts. We don't like him though, but yeah, he's been in the end. It's fine. Sai, Chicho, you poor thing. Only you would try to justify your own ends in the name of beings far above your station. You intentionally malign, malign the god's will. You may be a god, Morgan, but I see you've come to share the mortal's facile way of thinking. Pathetic. <laughs> No, I fully understand your intentions, Shichol. However, as you well know, I am a goddess of vengeance, and now my gaze is upon you. For the indignity I suffered being sealed away, for the years of sorrow you will pay a price. I hope you are ready. In the state you're in? You were just freed from the seal. No, we will not settle this today, Morgan. I will deal with you when next we meet. Shichol, come back here. I will at least commend you, frail one, for besting the glass glue behind me. Be sure that I will not forget this day. Gosh dang. Ooh, Aton Semini is the god. Burrito Supreme God. <laughs> There's so many references to recent content I just noticed. Oh, really? Crumb Crotch? I came as soon I was as I was able, but even so, it seems I arrived too late. I hope you are all alright. And even then, you bested the glass glue behind on your own. Thank you. We need to fill that hole. Yet, it, even with the glass glue behind defeated, these matters are far from finished. In fact, one could say this is but the beginning. No sooner has the dust from your battle settled than the true problems come into view. 
The dark mana the glass clue behind a release as it fell is a strange energy of a sort that controverts the natural order of Aaron. It warps the space around it, creating a path that links Aaron and this other world. That was what Chichol sought from the beginning. He desired to send the Dark Lords into Eren directly, bypassing the wards of the dungeons entirely. It is now inevitable that the Dark Mana will shatter those seals, and the two worlds will eventually be merged into one. <laughs> My face! <laughs> Return to Eren, and there help the mortal race is ready themselves for the former invasion, for they will surely come sooner or later. I will seal off this place, but I cannot serve as Bastion and Bulwark for Aaron alone. I fear Chichol's greed will end up uh, setting the world ablaze. Please ensure that no one else has to follow the path Moors had to take. Encourage the people of the world to grow in wisdom and might, that they might that they may stand against Chichol and the former's attempt to lay waste to Aaron. Is that why we have? Oh, what's now? Wait, is that why we have so many skills and we have to level up? It's because we're trying to get ready for the former invasion? Indeed, it is for the purpose that Mariota, or rather Mari, the shepherd of the soul stream, brought you to this world. Shepherd of the soul stream? M Mariota. The way... To Aaron lies open. Go now, and until we meet again, may the blessings of Lyman Lark and Aton Simony attend you. I will appear before you when the time is right. Wait, why is now here? Remember the path you have chosen to walk this day and all the days to come, the path to Aaron's guardian veiled in light. Now is Mari reincarnated? Oh! Growth spurt! Well, what is this? Oh, these are the credits. Oh, cool! We did it! Oh, wait! This is like photos of Moore's and when his daughter was born. Oh, shoot. Oh, these are cool pictures. Wow, so Mariota is now, but just reincarnated. Cool. <laughs> the artwork is the best. You unlocked more lore. I did. I get it. Y'all better be prepared for my next trivia in the future. <laughs> I'll be hitting you hard with lore next time. <laughs> Y'all thought you were safe. Gotta do a super easy trivia, so when the next one comes, it's gonna be so difficult. <laughs> Mari is Yoda? Yeah. Kinda sad she holds her father in his death. Oh, yeah. Cause, she, yeah, well, wait, what do you mean hold? Mabinogi Masterpiece. Masterpiece. <laughs> This was deep for 2008, or more like 2004 in Korea. <laughs> Not lore trivia, it's 16 years of lore. Get ready, Giga. <laughs> we'll also have some math questions too. <laughs> I'm only playing. There's no more screenshots? Math? Yeah. If you were running at the speed of 40 miles per hour and you had 16 decks, how much damage would you do to a raccoon? <laughs> Good luck. Um, she's learning too much. Hi, Whitney! Gotta have that deep lore. <laughs> I mean, sometimes when I think of trivia questions, though, I always second guess myself. And then when I, because there's like a one trivia question I did, like for Zelda, and I think technically I was wrong in the answer. Oh my god! And Kahoot, how you do Kahoot is if 
the answer's the answer. Like, I can't, like, delete it and give you your points back. So, I hope that doesn't happen in future trivias. By the way, did y'all like the trivia event yesterday? We did one yesterday. <laughs> who was the qual- who is a part of the quality assurance team? A. Yeon Hyo Lee B. Kim Jong Un Or Jong Un Kim I'm just kidding. We would never be like that. That would be crazy. Jung Ho Yu Sang Min Can't read it. Special thanks to all the Mabinogi, Mogi, Mabinogi players, Mabinogi guilds, fan sites, oh, and me. Oh, did you see that? And me. Me. <laughs> oh, Doc. Wow, look at that. 2003 to 2004. Gosh dang. You were around back then? Wild. I know. Crazy. Oh, look at that. Me and my little bunny teacup. It's a boy. That was the old loading screen. We did it! We did it! Who saved the goddess? Woo! I'm free. Wait, were you stuck that whole time? Sorry. <laughs> I think that's probably because of when I first started playing. That's okay. Well, now you're watching, so now you'll know what I know. <laughs> we have, uh, 130 to go. Oh, you <laughs> mean generations? We do have a lot more generations to do. But I finished my first one today! I finished generation one. Next one is, uh, this one, I think? Generation 2 automatically starts after completing. Oh, it automatically starts. Oh, I guess now I have to become a Knight of Light. Maybe that's to help with the former war that's about to begin. What do you mean, finally? It, did that take that long? I mean, I guess it kind of took a little while. It's okay. You have to complete the quest in your quest log. Oh. Oh! Complete. Oh. And this starts the next one. Can you hear my voice? Do you hear me? Hi, Jian! Thank you for subbing! Welcome to our fairy family. The ranks of the formers are swelling. The Dark Lord is gathering his forces. So this is how it automatically starts. Well then. At this rate, the formers will soon sweep over the blessed lands of Eren. Follow the path of the Guardian of Light. Protect Eren. Man, I, I feel like this would look so funny if I had like a silly outfit on. The path of the Guardian of Light is one of the one of endurance of patience and penance. I like how slow this is. It lets me have time to read it. Go to a main matcha, maka, uh, the hollowed birthplace of the Knights of Light. Those brave souls who seek to defend Aaron from the formers gather there, and there shall you find the path. Mm. The main. Your name is the immutable hope of Aaron. If you do not find the power to safeguard mankind with while Chicho replenishes his power, Aaron's future will lie shrouded in darkness. Well, that's not good. I ask of you, make your way to a main and become the guardian of light. 
Wow, her hair is long. I will ever be watching over you. I should probably write some of these questions down for future trivia. <laughs> we'll see. Poof! She poofed. Ads were making me mad. I'm sorry. Thank you, I did. I did for the fine gaming song. You're now part of our fairy family. They had an event recently where you got a Morgan related title called Can You Hear Me Once Again? Makes sense from this cutscene now. Oh, about how in cutscenes you look silly. I wonder how Effin looks while he's doing these cutscenes. <laughs> oh, goodness. <sighs> she paid a lot for that hairstyle. <laughs> the longer the hair, the more costly it is. Cool. Oh, what is this? I got an enchant scroll called Goddess. G1 Advent of the Goddess Clear Reward Box. Ooh, I got AP Potion and I got a Golden Experience Fruit, but it doesn't expire. Nice. Actually, I need to figure out what do will expire. Okay. This will expire soon. Alvin Knight's Training Stone Selection Box. But I don't know... I don't know what this is. I don't know which one to choose. I think it's okay. Hmm. Evan should take a screenshot. <laughs> Long hair and hair physics. Morgan had that gold for real. <laughs> You might be able to sell the stone. Yeah, let me know, cause I'm not really sure. I get I get a ton of these and I'm not, I just don't know what to do with them. Oh my God, are y'all penguins? Penguins. Oh. Since they have CalCon, maybe I won't do CalCon, maybe we'll do penguin. Penguin day. <laughs> that sounds so lame. <laughs> Penguin day. Okay, let me close this. Yellow equals difficulty. Heroic. Red. You should choose an unlimited stone. Green. Party max. Damage. Silver. Oh. oh. Okay, all of these are used to get SS rank on Albin runs that people do. Um, okay, uh, I have two. Uh, so I should choose red because it's heroic. Oh, this one, a limited. Alvin Knight's Training Stone Unlimited. Oh, I see. So Heroic, the Yellow Heroic, the Red Unlimited. <clears throat> Green Party Max Damage 50%. Silver, oh my god, there's so many green. Damage 500%. Oh my god, there's so many. You can't sell these, I tried. Oh, you can't sell these? Club Penguin. <laughs> okay, y'all. <laughs> oh, these probably can't be sold because they're from like the time limited ones. The 2 million one is in there. I thought I was being smart. Darn, but good to know for the future. I would choose a hidden floor then like Paradise of Gems. Okay, what color is that? Uh, 
blue. Oh. Does it matter which one? This is a ranger one. Hidden floor, hall of rangers. Pa oh, paradise of gems. Okay, I'll choose that one. Paradise of gem. It's gonna expire soon. <laughs> In 23 hours. Jeez. All right, let's see. Now that I finished G1, that's kind of the main thing I really wanted to do today. I didn't really want to start Generation 2 yet. I want to take my time doing the Generations, otherwise, if I rush through them, I feel like I wouldn't appreciate them as much. You could try to run it. I'm pretty sure you can unlock the Alvin Training Ground. Is this the Alvin Training Ground? This thing? Or is it something different? Oh, what, jousting prelims are right now? Oh, that's different. Hmm. hmm. I mean, I did just get a gym, so I guess I could. You unlock Albin Training Grounds through G19? Oh. Sometimes I want to wait for these generations, but it's going to take me a while to get there. I find stories stick with you less if you rush through them. Yeah, that's why I don't really want to rush through. Um, I did want to do some cooking dungeons because I wanted to level up my rank, my cooking rank, but I need to buy that book. But in order to buy the book, I need to um, buy it with the cooking dungeon... Uh, what are these things called? The Royal Court Food Delivery. I think I want to do that. I think I might want to do that. Same premise, different areas. I mean, I kind of skipped a lot of what was said when I was doing this. <laughs> I kind of just chose that random. Probably not a good idea, but alas, I did it anyways. <laughs> but the cooking dungeons are solo, right? <laughs> I still want to try though and I know that the cookie dungeons are also I think in one of the generations too but whatever also I need to do jousting are you at the jousting thing orca hold on because my ticket will expire in nine hours so I just don't want to hold on to that these both will expire It's okay to do an emblem in Dunbar. No need to rush doing it, but it's a fun dungeon. G19 is a good one to start in tandem with others as it's a unique storyline. Like, you don't have to go from 1 to 25 in order, but you do things at your pace. Oh, is the game music kind of loud? Is that better? Orca! Can we register? Oh, not yet. We can't register yet. I like Generation 1. I thought it was good. Some stuff kind of... was mm, a little hard for me to grasp, but I kind of just accepted it. But other than that, I think it was pretty good. It's not like soul changing. But y'all said that it was back in, what, 2004, 2008, so that's fair. <laughs> I guess that's fair. The translations aren't the best. That's what I'm kind of assuming it is. Like, that's kind of why that a lot of stuff was kind of like, ooh, you know? Like, it didn't, it didn't make me be like, ah, oh, that's the connect, got it. But sometimes, some of the things I just had to accept. You don't need to do G19 for Albin training. You probably have the quest already for it. Probably.
probably wouldn't it be best to just wait to do this stuff until I unlock it in the generations though or no also maybe I already did the quest the thing is I needed to do a Baltane mission because I think Walter's part-time job thingy had me do it and then that's how I unlocked it but I never paid attention because I literally just wanted to hurry up and get it so that was my bad, but I'm assuming it's the same thing. No, y'all, wait, y'all are talking about something different. Sorry, I'm a little confused. I didn't feel like I missed out while I was doing 9 through 12 at the same time as 19 through 20, but I understand. Gotcha. You don't unlock it in the generation. It's under basic Albin Knights training ground. It's like a dungeon. It doesn't really have strong significance with the generation. Up to you. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, that's... <laughs> I need to add it to my ever-growing list of things to learn about in this game. Right now, though, I want to do... I want to do jousting. Actually, do I want to do it? I don't think I want to do it. I take... I change my mind. I don't want to do it right now. I'll do it tonight. <laughs> it's just because I don't want to sit here and wait. I want to go to learn how to do the cooking dungeons. So let me go to the thingy. Oh, I also have to do Grandmaster missions too. Let me see what my Grandmaster missions are. Hi, Sprags! Oh my god, it's been 10 months! Hello! Happy Monday! How are you doing today? Hello. You do get Crusader experience in addition to the dungeon rewards for completing it, which won't have any effect until you unlock the Crusader skills from G19. I think that's what people meant. Oh, okay. Hmm. How can I be of service, sir? Give me the first mission. Thank you. Got one. I'll look at it in a second. Second mission. Wait, what? Did I never finish? Oh, I never did this. I never finished the zombie one. Uh. If I do the zombie one, will it count? Or should I forfeit it and just get a new one? I guess I forgot about it. I got another defeat the red dragon. It will count. Okay. Does that mean I can get two? Hmm. Yes. Ooh. FN, do you also have a red dragon? We have passes for red dragon, so we might as well use them. They're gonna expire in three days. <laughs> Not today, go figure. Hi, Artel. I'm gonna go learn about cooking dungeons. Leveling cooking. Cooking dungeons. I would just grab missions for different talents when I didn't feel like doing them and stack them up and then do a bunch at once. Got it. So much better to do it like that. Just to stack it up. Okay. Alright, Gluis. Is your shop still selling the books? Am I gonna have to buy him his stupid... Dang it, I'm gonna have to get likability potions again, open up his shop. <laughs> oh well. Um, I need to remember how many of each thing I needed though. One second. How do you spell his name? Gluius. Uh, 
Okay, so I need 10 of number one. So 10 bronze, 15 silver, and 20 gold. But I'm gonna need way more than that. Interesting, I wonder how this works. So let's just maybe, maybe, the, maybe the red is the easiest one. Fruit juice recipe. Recipe containing directions on how to make fruit juice. If your cooking rank is F or higher, you can enter the dungeon. Click on the iron pot. Okay. All right. I'm going to make an attempt. Oh, wait. I probably can't be in a party, can I? Oh. Interesting. Look at his giant... <laughs> Look at his giant ladle. Okay, what do we do? What do I do? Oh, I just hit him. Do I have to hit him in the red circle or can I just kill them normally? Is that silver tableware? Cooking knife? Wait, what do I have to do? Wait, this one's not wanting to get hit. Or not wanting to... Oh god. You have to use the cooking knife to hit them? Oh, cooking knife. Excuse me, guys. Is there a way I could read on how to like properly do this? Oh my god, that's a big knife! Oh, I got the master of combat. Oh, and then now can I hit him? Oh, I see. So you have to like hit him with the knife first. Oh, that's. Oh, I get it. I get it now. Got it. How do I know how much... Er... Hmm. Maybe I should have read this on Wiki. <laughs> huh. You have to kill the amount listed. Oh! 21 pieces of fruit, 12 spoonfuls of water, hit the fork about, at, and hit the fork after five minutes has passed. Oh, shoot. I killed a silver tableware. Who, I mean, everybody needs a little bit of metal in their food, don't they? <laughs> it's all good. So we're basically making food. Oh my God. Oh, that was good. That was not very good. Oops. So I need more water. Okay, look, I hit them. Hmm, I wonder if this would be easier if I did something different. Like, not be archer. Like, maybe I windmill instead? How much time do I have? What happens if I... Tableware is okay. Try not to cook a rat. A rat? Oh god, there's a rat! Get it out of the pot? What if I just leave it in there? And not hit it. And like not kill it. Hmm. 
Hey now. There we go. I caught two. Oh, here. Here, let me hit the rat out of the pot. There we go. Good. There we go. All right. I need... I have 13 fruit. Okay. I hate how you have to hit with the knife first. There we go. Oh no, there's another rat! As long as that other guy doesn't kill the rat in the thing. It's kind of hard when it's positioned here. Oh god. No, I hate getting interrupted! There. Does that count as not? I'm at 16 for only two more water. What happens if I do this right? Like. All right, water's almost done. Okay, 12 waters, done. So 21 fruit. Only one more, one more fruit. <laughs> Come hither. There. Now what? Hit the hit the fork after five minutes has passed. What's the fork? Oh, this thing. Has it been five minutes? Ah! Did I do it? The dish looks a bit embarrassing. <laughs> But take the food out of the box and show it to Gluis. Oh, I guess I needed to do this faster. Okay. You mixed it for too long. All the sugar dissipated. Oh. I failed! What? Oh, I got fruit juice. I had three star fruit juice. Isn't bad. Oh, look. A ladle and a cooking pot. I'm taking that. <laughs> Wait, do I leave now? Oh, I failed. Does that mean I don't get any um, of these thingies? Show food. What an embarrassment. You should be ashamed. I can tell you tried hard, so I'll still give you a gift. <laughs> wow. How many did I get? One? <laughs> what? Why? One? That sucks. Freaking, yeah, it's like the Gordon Ramsay of Mavnogi. There isn't a last time in the top corner. Okay, so as long as I finish before five. <laughs> Well, shoot, do y'all have any recommendations? How do I do this better? Because I need a total of 10. I need one more brown one. Dang it. I want to try that again. I Now that I know what to do, maybe it's okay. It's out of stock. What do you mean it's out of stock? It's better to get less ingredients than overdo it. Oh, and just hit the fork in time? Oh, okay. Can I only do this like once a day? Oh, change channels? Okay, well, should I do egg maybe? Egg? 
Maybe I can do an egg mission. Oh, can we really not bring people to do this with us? This has to be solo? Try using Mirage Missile on the mobs. Okay. Thanks, guys. All right. I will do better this time. Okay, what do I need? 28 eggs, 13 spoonfuls of salt. Hit it when it's six minutes has passed. Can y'all do me a favor? Can y'all do me a favor and let me know when six minutes is coming up? How do I get that fork or that knife again? It kind of, I don't know how it dropped. <gasps> A rat. Okay, I got it out of the pot. Okay, hold on, let me. Oh, dang it. I got the tilt silverware in it again. Gosh darn it, these stupid rats. Die, you fiend. Got another one? Hold on. Should I focus on the rats? Oh no, I got it in the food. <laughs> no! No! No, I suck. Oh, there's a cooking knife. Should I just give up since it's gonna be totally gross? I mean, it's a bit of protein. Some protein won't hurt you. <laughs> yum! Yum, yum! Rat soup. Yummy, yummy. Woo! Dang it, I hate when it goes off to the side. Stay in! How much salt do I need? 13. Curse protein. <laughs> oh, wait. Whoa, crit hit. There we go. That was good. That wasn't bad. Come on, Gluish. You have to hit hit him better. Oh, wait. That's actually pretty good. Okay. I think no more salt. I think it's good. Has it been six minutes? That's not how you make ratatouille, Kylie. <laughs> I'm going to focus on the eggs. Dang it, I feel like I ruined it with the stupid rat. Gosh darn it. How many eggs? 28 eggs. Gotta chop the egg. 
Why does it do that? It, you have to like hit the egg first and then it's like weak. Okay, come here, Mr. Egg. Gluis is like, oh dang, he didn't go in the pot. He's like so attached. There we go. He's so attached to that one little salt guy. Okay, I can't, I can't kill any more spice. Oh shoot, I have 15 spice. <laughs> hmm. Mm, elapsed time 5.30. Okay, so it's almost time. Did that land? Okay, I have 28 eggs, so I'm not gonna do any more. I have too much spy- I have too much salt and I have a rat. <laughs> Should I do it exactly at six or should I, should I leave now? Oh, it's six. There we go. Oh, I got 93 points. <gasps> that was better. The dish seems to have come out pretty well. Take the, see, nothing hurts with a little bit of protein. That's not bad. Look, I did it. I did it. Got my fried egg. What is it? Five star, right? Oh, four star. Not the Oh, wait. Exit. Four star egg. Look at that egg. This is, this is kind of fun. I like it. It's kind of annoying, but kind of fun. This would be more fun if you do it with somebody. <gasps> Look it. Wow, you're a natural. See, oh, he, they don't know, you know, they don't, he doesn't know that there was a little rat in there. That's a secret, that's my secret ingredient. Rat. Nice. How many did I get? I got four. <gasps> okay, good. I have enough to buy the book. How do I get silver? Do I have to do like, um... Like a higher level one, or? <laughs> rat meat feels okay, man. Yeah, just a little rat not hurting body. Mmm, yummy. How do I get a silver one? Precise timing is the key. Mmm. So basically just stop what you're doing and hit the fork at the right time. Got it, got it. By the way, thank you for helping me keep track of time. Hi, Super Dan. How do I, how do I get the silver ones, guys? Royal Court food delivery list. I'm looking at the wiki. Oh, delivery list too. So salad, seafood, fried rice, and herb garlic steak. Those are the ones that... So let's do a salad. Let's make a, a good salad. Yeah, salad. I'll make y'all a salad, chat. <laughs> Finger licking good. Mmm, salad. Nothing sounds better than a salad right now, right guys? Ah, uh, what do we need? 22 pieces of fruit. Oh, this is a fruit salad. Perfect. Fruit salad. Y'all know the wiggles. Yummy, yummy. Okay, and then what else? Vegetables, fruit, eggs. Got it. And we have to hit the after nine minutes have passed. Got it. Okay. You know, I realize that maybe that's the thing. Yeah, that thing drops the knife. Got it. But it doesn't seem to like really affect anything. Oh no, there's a rat. Oh, 
Oh, well, that was really bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> I thought I could, like, slightly poke it. Darn it, and I, I just totally killed it. It's okay, it's my secret ingredient. Secret ingredient. My secret ingredient. I need some like good cooking music on. Do y'all know some good cooking music? Should I put on my campfire cooking song from that anime? Have y'all seen that anime? It's so good. I love that anime. How many? I've honestly just been killing randomly. So, 22 pieces of fruit, 19, and then 12 eggs. Okay. Did that go in? I should probably be focusing on the ones that Gluis is killing, because it might be faster. I'll be going now. Wait, he's dead? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. You need to wake up. Excuse me. He can die? <laughs> I didn't know he could die. Oh my god. I didn't notice he could just die. <laughs> well, lesson learned. Oh, I like how I hit all of them. Oh, it's a rat. Okay, if I do this, there, then he'll come to me. So then he'll attack me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just need to get to the other side of it. Um... Dang it! Stop it! Get out of my soup! There we go. That's better. Or wait, my salad, not my soup. <laughs> I feel like the eggs are so easy. Lazy Town cooking by the book. <laughs> what? I'm not talking about meme songs. I'm talking about actual nice music to listen to. <laughs> la, 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 la. Has it been okay? Not. It's only have we only we're doing okay. It's only been what f almost five minutes. We still have nine. Ooh, fine leather. Nice. I'll take that. Gotta hit them all. Ugh, not another rat. Come over here, Mr. Rat. Come over here. Hmm. No, no, no. Get out of the soup! Yeah. I get so distracted with the darn rat. There we go. Not bad. How many is that? 14 vegetables? Okay. Doing good. Doing good. 
Hi, Crimson! How are you doing? Another rat. Not another one. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Oh. Ah! Okay. Got it. Okay. We have six minutes. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? Maybe I don't have to, as long as they're they're not dead in the soup, it doesn't matter, right? Look at this guy looking at me. There we go. Super salad. <laughs> How many? Oh, I think I'm I'm done with the fruit now. So now I just gotta focus on the vegetables. So these leafy greens. Dang it. And then how many more eggs? 12 more eggs. I really, I take a beating in this game, man. that egg count? It didn't count, did it? All right, vegetable. Uh, oh shoot, I did too many vegetable. All right, egg. Focus on the eggs. Egg 11. One more egg. Come here, Mr. Egg. You're gonna make me come to you, aren't you? There, all right. That's a good amount. Now I just have to wait exactly for nine minutes. It's almost nine. It's 8.30 right now. Here we go. How are you doing today, Crimson? Hi, Locust. Just started Tears of the Kingdom at Christmas and started watching your YouTube VODs. I love how excited you are when you play the game. I love, ah, oh, that was a good time. I loved it. Uh-oh, they're gonna... They're gonna make this hard for me, aren't they? Uh-oh. 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 Please don't. Please don't. I need to hit this at nine. Oh, oh. I did it. Nice. I got 93.2 points. <laughs> Tell ya, rat's not so bad. Look at my salad. Woo. That's a good salad. Why do I always do that? That's a good salad. Reminds me when my family was at a restaurant and they asked my little sister if she wanted super salad. She said yes. <laughs> I afraid, I'm afraid I do that a lot too. I'm like, yes. I want that. <laughs> I usually mean like the last thing that they say. You're a natural! This is good enough to serve the royal family! Rat salad. Hmm, who would have known? Yum. How many did I get? I got three. How do I get, like, the big amount? I need, like, more. Oh, I think I have to do herb garlic steak. And then I get five if I've, if I've done good. Okay, herb garlic steak. All right, time to step it up a notch and make some steak. All right, no, no rat this time. No rat this time. Also, I have to protect him. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm just gonna start killing. Okay, let's see. 43 pieces of meat? Holy cow. That's a lot of meat. Okay. 
Uh, let's try to get the silverware out of the pot. Darn it, it didn't count. But maybe it's okay. But it did drop a cooking knife, so I'm gonna grab that. All right, I need to do more Mirage Missile, right? Also, I need to protect this guy. Sir, I can't, I can't help. So I can't help when you like do it this way, then I can't get them in the pot. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Darn it! Freaking got the rat. <laughs> I give up on trying to not have a rat in my... I give up. It's too hard. give up. Or do I? Hold on. Oh, God. No! Oh! No! How long have I been playing this game? Uh, like a month? I think. There we go. There we go. Got him out. <laughs> no. Go this way. And that way. How many meat? We have 20 pieces of meat. 12 vegetables. Er, 21 piece Herb and cheese. Wait. Where's the vegetables in this? Oh, is the... Oh, that's the herbs, I guess? The vegetables are the herbs? Okay. <laughs> oh, this is kind of nice. Wait, did he not hit this one? No, not the rat again. Darn it! I got three, I got three rats in it this time. <laughs> no! What time do I have to do this in? 13 minutes? Jeez. What did you do to Ratatouille? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Look at the meat. I'm poisoning the meat. Come on, hit him. Why do you always have to hit them towards the wall? <laughs> oh. Okay. We're at 33. There's so much meat that spawns. Get out of the way. That didn't do anything. <laughs> this 
This one's gonna be extra special. Are you working on another Grandmaster? Yeah, I've been working on the Warrior one. Dang it. I'm at 39, 40. Oh, I need some more herbs. Does, does the game help me out by spawning things that I need? Uh oh, that was gonna knock the cheese out. What? How did that fly backwards? I hate when he hasn't touched them yet. Die! At least he's still alive. To, like wait for the rat to get on like the side there we go there we go <laughs> all right meat is almost done vegetables almost done okay cool we're doing good i think i need only one more piece of meat so let me choose one freaking cheese there okay meat is done all right, I'm gonna focus on the vegetables now. There. Okay, what about the cheese? Cheese, I need three, three more. Nice. Two more. I need to hurry up and kill the rat before... What? Dang it! Wait, I think I'm done with the vegetables. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. Okay. I think I gotta stop. Oh god, I'm probably gonna add more. Oops. Alright, I need one more cheese. Oh, no, we're good. Alright, that's enough. <laughs> we're good now. Now I have to wait for 13 minutes to pass. So, uh, I'll just, uh, keep the rats out of the, the, the food. Never mind. Oh my god. Well, you know, it is called steak, right? We're making steak. So, they just don't know what kind of meat is in the steak. So, it's good. I've never had him die on me before. <laughs> There's a first for everything, okay? <laughs> Ew. It's okay. What they don't know won't hurt them. So it's okay. And I don't think he'll do any damage. If I don't do anything, it's fine. We just unfortunately have to wait until the 13 minute timer has appeared. The problem is I can I can accidentally kill Um I can accidentally kill the rat again in this in this red circle even when I'm not trying to. Wee. Wait, why does it say 49? Wait, it doesn't have to be in the red circle? You just have to kill them? Oh, I thought it had to be in the red circle. Wait, am I not supposed to hit the rats at all? No, if I hit the rats out of the red circle... How did I get up to 49? Oh, the Mirage Missile killed more. I see, I see. 
Okay, it's 10.45. I'm gonna hide behind the fork. Oh, here. Hide. I can legit hide. In case they want to attack me. They can't attack me. If I finish the food and there's still rats running around, then it's okay. Huh. I guess I'll just have to be more careful with Mirage. Maybe Mirage Missile will only do it at, like, the beginning. Oh my god, this is gonna take a while. Do you think I'll get five? The maximum I can get from doing the herb garlic steak is five if my score is between 90 to 100. I think this qualifies as, an, as a 90. Right, chat? This qualifies as a 90. Does cooking knife kill the monster better? The cookie knife doesn't do anything. It just hits them with one. Oh, just kidding. I take that back. <laughs> well, now we're at 51. <laughs> take that back. We When they first appear... Oh. When they first appear, it... Oh, I need to probably turn this off. Deactivate. When they first appear, it doesn't do that much damage. Oh god. It only does like one. There we go. Alright, I gotta sit here. But yeah, I guess I can't... Don't try to attack me, Mr. Rat. Oh, actually, yeah, attack me there. Yeah, stay out of the food. Okay. Well, I'm doing this exactly at throw. Oh, there it is! 13! Oh, you call that food? No! Is it because it was too much rats? No! No! Oh my god, it doesn't even give me anything. Are you kidding me? Darn it. Well, that was a failure. You poo poo head, you kidding me? I want to do that again. I want to redo it. Hold on. I got to change channel, y'all said. <sighs> if it had only one rat, it was probably okay, but it had too much rat. I just got to be careful, I think. I'll be more careful. Oh, wait, I don't have any food to show. Here we go. Let me try again. Dang it. Okay. Uh. Okay, Gluis, do your thing. So this is where Mirage comes into play. There we go. Should I be picking up this cheap leather? I think I need to stop doing Mirage. Also, let me see if I can hit this thing out. There we go. So then I can pick up the cooking knife. Oh wait, I can't pick it up? Oh, there we go. There we go. Now I just gotta kinda stay in the center and they'll die on their own. Like flies. Ha 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 ha. The problem with this technique though is if a rat appears, I have to kill it almost immediately, which is not good. Oh no, okay, this isn't good. All right, Mr. Rat. Oh God, oh no, this isn't good. 
Oh, well, yep, that's not good. <laughs> Darn it! There's like no winning! I... Oh no. Oh, oh, here we go, here we go. There. How did it not go back? Are you kidding me? I used Mirage Mi or not Mirage, I used uh, Magnum Shot. Darn it. Gosh darn it. He was already knocked back. Is that how that works? Dang it. You should just wait until it gets closer to the edge to kill it. Well, the problem, the problem with waiting was I was using Mirage Mis Missile. Maybe I should just not use Mirage Missile. But I was using Mirage Missile and and it got poisoned. So if I didn't try to kill it right away, it would have um, it would have just fallen in a circle. Natural causes of death, poison. But this is a good trick. <laughs> Maybe I can get lucky and a rat just won't appear again. Hit it with a knife and windmill, then for rats you magnum. What do you, wait, what do you mean? Oh, instead of using Mirage. Not a bad idea. I like how there's an AoE to this, though. There, I got the rat out. There we go. That was good. I got lucky though. I got lucky. How how are we on the amount? Let's see. So I need 43 pieces of meat, 21 vegetables, 16 cheese. I think I'm going to stop doing Mirage Missile now. So hopefully two is okay. <laughs> no. No. Oh, there we go. We got him out. Woohoo. There's two of them. There's three of them! There, got one out. Got another one out. Oh, I got all of them out! Woo, look at that! So good. <laughs> yeah! All right, how much more? 43 meat? Okay, almost. Okay. 
Okay. So that's 41. Didn't mean to do that. How many vegetables? I'm at 23. Oh, no more vegetables. What am I doing? No more vegetables. 16 cheese. Okay, I need to focus on the cheese. And then... Two more meats. If I do this, well... Okay, we're good. Maybe I can get this vegetable out. Go out. There we go. Forty-two pieces of meat. I need just one more. There. Darn it, I got four, but oh well. Or 44. <laughs> 23, and then just a couple more cheeses and I'm done. All right, one more cheese. I guess I have to summon the have to summon the cheese. Oh no. Not a rat. There we go. Got him out. Got him out. Woohoo! Darn it, I just need one more cheese. Where's the cheeses? Summon yourself. Darn it. Why does it summon everything now? Hi, Mai! How are you? Uh-oh. There. Okay. <laughs> they don't want cheese to summon anymore, apparently. Darn it! We're getting everything but what I need. There. <laughs> Finally, the cheese has shown. Okay, this is better. There's 44 meat, so there's only one extra meat. There's only two extra vegetables, just the right amount of cheese, and I have to wait, how many more minutes? 13? So it's 11 right now, so. Yay! Maybe this will be better. And I only have two rats this time. Only two rats. Yay. I'll let them hit me. I won't die from these guys, so that's okay. Um, let's see, what is this? This sounds like nice, relaxing, relaxing music. I have to admit, the cooking dungeon's frustrating as heck. <laughs> Who created this? I have words for you. But this makes me hungry. 
I might take my lunch break after I finish this. Okay, we're at 12. 15. We have to wait for that to be exactly 13. Send them your rat soup. <laughs> yeah. Man, it's hard getting these things. How much are how much do these sell for? I have to buy a freaking book. I might just skip it, to be fair, and just use all of these. I wanted to learn, but like, oh man. Because each book you have to buy costs like X amount of the, um, like, lists. All right, it's almost time. Please let me hit the fork when it's time. Oh, there you go. Oh no, I got 77. Well, not so bad. Dang it, that means I only get three. <laughs> that sucks. Mission failed. It didn't fail. Dumb. I guess you can't have any rats on the later ones. Darn it. Ah, at least I got three. <laughs> what a butthole. Okay. Well, that's okay. How many how much more how many more do I need? I needed uh ten of the brown. 15 of the silver, and then 20 of the gold. I don't even have this. I, or, yeah, 20 of the gold. Uh-uh. That ain't happening. I'm gonna use this. <laughs> Screw this. Train my cooking. Question, though. It only goes to 50. So, should I, like, try to make this cooking stuff? Would that be enough to go over? Hmm. Maybe. Should I... Oh, I can't rebirth yet. When this says two hours, does that mean two in game hours or two real life hours? No, I'm not dry. I use training seals for all my cooking. Oh, real life hours. Okay, well, I can do it in two more hours and then I can switch to cooking talent. Too bad I didn't have that little talent thing expired, unfortunately. But yeah, I guess I could just work on cooking. Or work on the, the cooking. Get rid of that. Alright. Cool. Does cooking in games ever get you hungry? This one doesn't. <laughs> but yes, you're right. Sometimes when it, the cooking looks really good. That in anime. Watching anime or like the anime movies that have like the food... Like, what never ceases to make me hungry every time I watch it is Howl's Moving Castle when they're making, like, the eggs and bacon with Calcifer. Oh, my God. That always makes me so hungry <laughs> watching. <laughs> so, I can't, I can't ever watch that part without, like, already being full. Because then it makes me want to have eggs and bacon. I couldn't watch Free Run with you guys. Oh, why not? Did you have issues? The cake scene in Matilda. <laughs> with the giant chocolate cake. I felt bad, though. I don't feel like that one... I mean, it looks good. But then it always makes me feel bad for that kid that was forced to eat the cake. Do you want to build a snowman? It's not enough snow to build a snowman. Well, uh, Cooking Dungeon was cool, but I don't want to do Cooking Dungeon again. Holy cow. I think what I want to do is uh, level up my cooking just a bit. Let's see. What would be the best place to go to? I like Cooking by Glynis because she has, like, all the food. And then she has like an oven buyer. There's a campfire spirit. Oh wait, I think I, 
Oh yeah, Luna wanted to send me a jumbo mooncake. <laughs> Thank you. Jumbo mooncake. Hmm. I got all my cooking from rank eight plus with skill seals. How do I get more skill seals? Cause I have, I have these two. But I only have three and I want to be kind of like careful with that. Let's see, hold on. You can get them from dungeon voucher shops. Dungeon voucher shop. I'm so sorry. Oops. Dungeon vouch. Oh, right, 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 right. Dungeon voucher shop. This, right? Yes, they're right there. Those are three. Or 30. These are 30. Oh, this is 15. Hmm. Are you talking about these? <laughs> Aren't 15 a little too low? Oh my god, this thing is massive. Oh my gosh, you share it with 10 people. Holy cow. Um, let's see. I want to cook, but I don't know what I need to cook. And then my talent is set to magic right now. In order to move, to change my talent, I need a rebirth. But I have like one other hour to do that. Maybe I don't work on cooking right now. And I just wait. I got one piece of fine leather. I've been slowly collecting. I wish the cooking dungeon was with more people. Is there a way to add more people to the cooking dungeon? It would be like a lot more fun with people than doing it solo. I wonder why they even like have you do that. Like why does it have to be solo? Saw the news that the stores were bare in Dallas. It's because they were, Oakley. They are usually that low. The event ones are 50 or 100. Oh. Do I have a cooking truck? No. I don't have a cooking truck. I don't know why they do that. Right? Like, it's more fun with friends. Like, why solo? Why? Why solo? Here, I guess while I wait, I can, like, look what I need to do. Make pasta. How do you make pasta? Rolling pin, cookie table. Mm -hmm. Is there, like, an easy one? Pasta dough. Wheat flour, egg. The cooking dungeon just stinks. I wish it didn't, because I had fun. Pasta dough, water, and an egg? How do you get pasta dough? Pasta dough. Hmm. Pasta dough. Wheat flour and an egg. Oh. Oh, duh. That's pasta dough. Oh, I guess I have to make... If I make this... Then I can make this. And then I would... But I probably don't have to make that many. It's only making three of them. That's not so bad. I could probably do this. <laughs> what channel am I on? Uh, channel 6? No, channel 7. 
Maybe the cooking dungeon is fun a few times, but there's several cooking ranks that use it. Yeah. Yeah. Seeing all the books. Like, the book I have to get, like, levels it up to 100%. The good son? And it does 100%, but, like, it's so... It's so hard. It's annoying. Question. Does the talents and, like, the skill experience it just makes it that so that you don't have to do as many? Yeah? Okay. So, if I don't mind doing three, then it's okay. <laughs> Because I think I just want to do that right now instead of having to wait an hour. Reforges. True. I I did some reforges. I did this one. I got cooking training experience. It's only third rank, but I got this at least. The wait, I don't think I need that one. I think I need the cooking table. And then a rolling pin. What's that? Huh. Hi, what is that? Thank you. Pet adoption medal. This magical medal can hold a pet for adoption? Ooh. It's a cooking truck? There are some people who enjoy cooking dungeons and they make bank. I mean, I think it could be fun, but it's frustrating because of stupid rats. Well, thank you. Each pet can only be adopted five times. Pet adoption info. Oh, Fantasia snack truck. Oh, okay. Adopt a pet, adopt. What do I, it's a snack truck. So now you don't have to stand next to the cooking oven. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. How do I, um, how, what should I name it? <laughs> What's a good name for a snack truck? What about snackies? Snackies. Mm. Um, snacky time? <laughs> you can also NPC sell stuff to it. Oh, that's nice. You have the rock throwing action. You can hit the rats with the rock and then run them out of the ring before you kill them. Oh, that's not a bad idea. Miss Food Truck. Are tradable Fantasia pets full of dyes too? I don't know. Fatties galore, what? Um, Orca, you're good at names. Help me think of a name for my snack truck. <laughs> this is so random. Um, oh, I have to unsummon my broom. Oh, is that why? Maybe I could do snackies? Snackies. Snacky time. Dang it. Free tacos? Oh, what about big fat tacos? Big fat tacos, big fat <laughs> rat meat. No! <laughs> Snacking way. Oh my god. I love that one. Oh my god, I can. Snacking way. Ooh, Final Fantasy. I love it, cat. Oh, look how cute. Whoa. Thank you so much, Kira. Oh, oh god, I'm gonna run you over. Um Hope it helps. <gasps> oh my god, they have like popcorn and like bananas. Ooh. So wait, what do I do? Oh, 
Oh, I, here's... Oh, I can drive it, right? How do I... Manage inventory? Oh, open shop. Oh! <gasps> oh, wow. It's like my own personal Glynis. Nice. Oh, they also have cooking tools here. Ooh, what is this? Silkworm larva stew? Ew. Oh, they have tempura udon. Hmm. That's why it's nice, and you don't need a cookie of it anymore. So I just have to stand next to it, and it works. <laughs> so I can be anywhere? Oh! Cool, I'm gonna go somewhere that looks nicer. Here, I'll park my food truck near Dunbarton Square so people can come get some snackies. <laughs> Here you go, guys. I'm making food. Whoa. Oh, it gets smaller. <laughs> can I can I tell it to like sit? Like stay. Don't move. Oh, it's a four person mount? Oh! <gasps> oh my god, so I can taxi Orca and FN around? FN Orca, do you hear that? It fills water bottles? <gasps> Say, stay. S wait, stay. Stay. S stay. How do I do it? <laughs> How do I do this? Stay. Oh. Oh. Oh, it worked. Oh my God, you can command pets. <laughs> what the heck? What? Wait, I can do that with all my pets. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna make some pasta. Y'all want some pasta? Feed your pop, pop, was it popsta and lobster? Lobster and pasta. Pasta and lobster. Pasta and lobster. Uh, let me have this up. All right. All right, pasta and lobster. And you make pasta. So I think this one might be, because I think I have to make these. What the heck is that? Kraken ink? Yeah, I think I need to do this. I need to make wheat flour, and I need to get some eggs. Um, Let me go get some eggs. Time to go get some eggs, chat. Let's go get some eggs. I'm going to make y'all some pasta. Hi, chill. Custom pet AIs. Mm, oh, what's a chicken doing here? Hello, Mr. Chicken. I'm going to get your eggs, please. Nice. Chicken AFK spot. <laughs> Even the chickens have AFK spots in Dumbarton. Oh, thanks, blood. Thank you. Mm. Bloodlust, are you the one that gave me the cooking truck? Your Cura. That was really kind of you. How did you, how did you get that item? Cura Nakaname. Shred. What is he shredding? Oh, this chicken's going crazy. Give me your eggs, chicken. I don't know how many eggs I need, but I'm just gonna take a few. <gasps> Ooh, my egg gathering just leveled. You have to buy the pet adoption medals with an X. Oh shoot, you just you just did that for me from Gotcha? Oh, thank you. Wow, thank you. I promise I'll be the best chef on Mabinogi. I'll be the best chef. <laughs> Can y'all also teach me Dan's 
stuff? What is Dan stuff? Orca, were you doing Dan's? Was that you who I heard it from? Oh, your dreams friend. I float from stream to stream helping people. Oh, well, thanks. <laughs> Those are fighting words. No cook off time. <laughs> yeah. Get ready time. We got a new chef in town. <laughs> Chicken needs a break. Okay, Mr. Chicken. Speaking of cook-off, we need to do the cook-off part-time job, Orca. Dan Tailoring. Oh, okay. That was probably you that was talking about that then. You should, Dan, your Magnum and Crash Shot. Ooh, I got two eggs. After you maxed out rank one, you go to a place in a main and you can take a Dan test? Oh shoot, a test? They are kind of hard. You gotta get a certain amount of points in time. Oh. You hated mag shot Dan? Can I do it at any time or is it like only on Saturdays at 2 p.m. on channel 4? You have to blah blah blah. Emery. Am I clicking this chicken? Stop moving. Three times a day? Anytime you just need to have this skill rank one. Is it maxed out? Yeah, I think, yeah, they're maxed out. All of mine are maxed out, except urgent shot. Interesting. Um, I need to do Red Dragon today. I kind of want to do the hard one with you guys while I'm on stream. Because it's easier to get people that are kind of higher level <laughs> to help me <laughs> when I'm on stream rather than when I'm offline. It used to be Wednesdays at like 8 p.m. <laughs> Okay, I think this, I'll get a couple eggs from this chicken, and then I think I'm good. Hopefully I don't get hit. If you fail, that counts as a use. Oh. You have to do the four player one? Oh, speaking of. Me too! I have to do the four player one too. After I do my cooking, FN, do you want to work on Grandmaster missions and do Red Dragon and four player mission and whatever else? Okay, I think that's good enough. Do Saga to episode two. I'm not there yet. I didn't really want to mess up my generation quests. Um, but I have these Red Dragon um, quest that I got from a friend. So I wanted to use those, especially since they're gonna expire. Wait, is my pet still here? Or did I unsummon it? I think I unsummoned it. But wait, wait, actually, hold on. I'm missing a very key ingredient. How do I get wheat flour? I need 10 wheat. How do you get wheat? I have to reap it with a sickle near Tier Chanel. Okay. A sickle. Sickle. Okay. All right. I got to go to Tier then, I guess. We got to go get some wheat. <laughs> what the heck? Where's the wheat? Where's the wheat? Was that wheat? Grocery part-time job or windmill girl in tier. Oh, what is grocery part-time? Part-time job gives me wheat? Is this wheat? Wait, which one's wheat? This one or that one? This one, right? Wheat. 
wheat chaff. The wider ones are wheat. Oh, there we go. <laughs> the grocery part-time job gives you wheat flour directly. Is that better than what I'm doing? How much wheat flour does the part-time job give you? You gotta kill 100 goblins? Oh, that's so easy, Orca. That's just, um, uh, rafting. I don't know when to, like, stop clicking this one. Because sometimes it says it's dried out. So I don't understand what that means. <laughs> well, I'm expert chef now. See, it says it's dried out. Like, what does that mean? But then it dropped. What? So just go somewhere else to find wheat. The heck. It's five clicks per gathering node. I'll get the hang of it. Okay. I see. I crushed the wheat. <laughs> I did it again. What does that mean? How do you crush wheat? See, I don't know. It means you grab some bad wheat. <laughs> okay. One, can you remind me what your username is in the Mavinogi? I wish there was a way that I could, um, like put it in like Twitch, what your Mavi name is. It will say there is no more. But you shredded the wheat, but not in a good way. <laughs> Yin, okay, you, okay. I figured, but I wasn't sure. I don't know. You need 10, what? You need 10 wheat for one? Oh no. That's not good. <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh yeah, harvest song. Okay, hold on. Is this harvest song? Hi, Vesu. There. All right, is that good? Do I just do it like that and then I'm good? Do you have someone with sight to help you? Does somebody have sight? Do y'all have sight? What is a wheat chaff? What is sight? Is this where I need to stand? Oh. What does it do? <laughs> okay, I'll do part-time jobs if it's easier. But is it okay? I want to learn how to make wheat flour. I want to learn, chat. I want to learn. Hold on. And then I'll do part-time job, I promise. Let me just get like a few more. What is it? I'm at 25. Okay, so let me just get five more. <laughs> I can indeed see. <laughs> Orca! Do I want some? Uh, not right now. I wanna, I wanna... Oh. I wanna... Try. Ooh, there we go. I got two. 28. Oh. Give me your weed. Wait, stop it. Oh, <gasps> you got so many. I can't take it though. It's not mine. Get that classic Mavi experience. <laughs> classic. Okay. Holy cow. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, we're all in the wheat fields. This is kind of scary, right? Like, ooh, I'm gonna come and get you with my sickle. <laughs> I want this wheat. Can I take this? Oh, 
Yoink. By the water? Hold on. Click, 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 click. Oh my goodness. Stop it! I guess I should get my pet to do this, but I don't know which pet. How do I do this again? Is it control? There. But I don't know who picks it up. One of those are picking it up, I think. All right, I think this is good. Oh, it's supposed to open up party. <laughs> Y'all are so helpful. <laughs> I thought you were level IRL cooking. I thought you, wait, leveling IRL cooking? I'm doing that too. I'm doing that too. Slowly but surely, cooking no longer makes me freak out. Like it used to. Like it still does. I had a really bad experience with cooking in the past where I, my whole arm caught on fire. It was not a fun experience. Um, so cooking in real life is kind of hard for me because my heart rate goes up so much when I cook in real life, but it's gotten better. Okay, now what do I do? Um, I'm just following you, Doo Doo, since I think you know what to do. Hi, Tyler! Okay, what do we do now? Do I talk to her? Operate the windmill. It costs 100 gold for one minute. I'll do five minutes, I guess? It's not that much. What do I do now? Just touch it? Ooh! Here we go, meet wheat flour. Nice. Glad you're safe. It was like four years ago. So it's more just, uh, it just my heart rate goes up anytime I smell fire. And that's not really good when you're cooking because <laughs> it freaks me out and I'm really jumpy in the kitchen. That's why I don't allow, when I'm cooking, I don't allow anybody in the kitchen while I'm in the kitchen. Hi, B-Ro. Uh, Watching you play kind of makes me want to give it another try. Yeah, come join us. There's a lot of new people that have played, and the community is really, really nice. And if you want to, like, start the game with, like, a group of people who are new and were, are willing to help, I have a guild. I have a lot of people that are so kind in my guild. They've been helping, like, all of us. Because we have, like, some newbies, and then we have some people that are veterans, I would say. Oh, control C? Oh. Did I make enough? How do I use the wheat chaff? Let me use you. Hmm. I guess I can't use wheat chaff. All right, I made nine, so that's not bad. Okay, I do want to do the uh, Tara or not Tara the part-time job. Hold on, I'm gonna move this out of my way. <laughs> It's crazy how things have changed over the years, but the flower still uses this windmill. <laughs> Do, if y'all need any dye amps or metal dyes, let me know. I have a couple. Um, I also have this thick metal dye. Okay. I'm gonna eat this cookie. <laughs> okay. So we got all the eggs. Okay, I'm ready. All right, we're gonna make some pasta. Oh wait. I think I need a rolling pin is what it said.
This, right? Does what is the secret? Does anybody know the secret? <laughs> It got really badly burned, but it healed up. Yeah, mine mine healed up. I have a bit of a scar, though, on my left arm. From it. If you need anything, I'm also in your Discord. Same name as here. Just at me to get my attention. Okay. Those are for a different item. You can hold control and click on the item to equip it fast. Oh, I can hold control. <laughs> Okay, okay, so this is like 30, so this is 35, so maybe I just, like, that much, and then, maybe this? Oh, <gasps> ew! Less wheat than required. Okay, so less wheat. No, wait. Less wheat than required. So I need more wheat. Nice. Did that count? <gasps> Completed! Okay. Wait, I only needed to make one? <laughs> what? You can't, I did all that work to make one? Okay, well, it's almost there. I just have to do a couple more things. Successful in stir-frying a dish. <laughs> Darn it! Stir-fry. Okay. Uh... I always... What did I, oh, I made shrimp fried rice with this. But I had to make steamed rice to do it. Unless I should do something else. Maybe fried onion? Um, fried onion. Salt is the secret thing. Onion, garlic, salt. Okay, hold on. Let me put this here. Sorry if he landed on you. Is it a he? <laughs> okay, I need onion. I'll buy five onions. Five garlic. And five salt. That's pepper. That's whipping cream. Where's salt? Is this salt? Oh, salt. Close. All right. Here, I'll cook next to you. <laughs> okay. Got a stir fry onion and then salt. Cool. Where's the other 10%? Don't worry. Let's see, they said 47, this is so specific, 47% onion. Maybe like there, 40% garlic, I don't know. And then 13% salt. There we go. <laughs> it's so random. The amounts are so weird. There we go. Oh, I made a four star. That's my first one. Yeah. Do oh, I got two pages? Um. Wait, 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 wait. How many more do I need to make? Oh, it's done. I just need to make one. Oh, eat a delicious, deliciously stir-fried three-star. Wait, is it four-star? Would that count? Use. Did it work? It didn't work. I 
has to be three star. Okay. All right, let me try again then. I have to not make it as good, I guess. I was too good. Okay, I'll add more salt this time. We like our salt. Check wiki for ingredient percentage because of the game ones are wrong. Oh, there we go. Three star. Use. Yay! Cooking can now be upgraded. Woo! It's rank seven now. All about pies. Oh, we can make pies. <gasps> we can make jam? How do you make jam? Jam making. Uh, chocolate, baking, chocolate, whipped cream, sugar. Cool. Pumpkin jam. Ooh, strawberry jam. Lemon juice, strawberry. I'm gonna make strawberry jam. Strawberry, sugar, lemon juice. Strawberry, sugar, or sugar, sugar, this is baking chocolate, oh sugar, and then where's the lemon juice? Hmm, I guess I can't do that one. I mean, I guess I could, but I don't want to if I have to buy it. Or if I have to make it. I probably have to make it, don't I? Screw that! Let's do something else. Cheat the pokey! Can I buy apples? Maybe chocolate? Enter... Enter baking chocolate. Why does it say enter? Oh, baking chocolate, whipped cream, sugar. Baking chocolate, whipped cream and sugar. Okay, I'm gonna do this one. I'm just gonna do one though, because it seems like if I buy more, it's like a waste. And then sugar. Okay, here we go. All right. <gasps> we gotta get ready for Valentine's coming up, so we have to make chocolate in game. Ooh. <laughs> All right, 50%. All right. Wait, 50, 50, and 20? Mm -hmm. Hi, Lulu. I'm staying warm. We had snow this morning, though. How does this make sense? 50%, 50%, 20? <laughs> what? Chocolate. Oh, on the wiki it says 42% chocolate, 41 whipped cream, sugar is 17. They lied to me. Uh... I'm gonna do like right there. And then maybe like that, <laughs> I don't know, I'm guessing. I made a tasty dish. Look at that. <gasps> I made my own chocolate. It's three star, not the greatest, not bad though. All right, I need to make more pasta. Oh. Okay, let me make more pasta. Wait, what was I doing to wheat? Never mind. I only need wheat flour and egg to make pasta. Okay, okay. 
Thirty, thirty-five. <laughs> Kylie got a truck. Yeah, I got it as a gift. <gasps> I made the best pasta. Oh my god, I made my oh my god, I made a five-star pasta dough. Hey, I think that's the very first five star I've ever made. <laughs> Woo! Five star pasta! Wow. Okay, let me stir fry a dish. Let me do my onion again. Oh. Keep forgetting I need fire. Hi, Aaron. Kind of late, but happy new year. Happy new year. <laughs> Are you having a good year so far? Also, thank you for the 74 months. Sorry, I, I guess I didn't hear that. My bad. Thank you. Hi, Terrell. Oh, Are y'all having a good Monday? It's Martin Luther King Day. Okay, let me summon this. Here, I wanna move this guy. Stay. There. Okay. I kinda wanna not block. There. Does this count? Am I still close? Oh god. Maybe I have to go like this. There's just so much going on. I'm gonna close these. There we go. Mm, stir fry, onion, salt. There we go. Okay, so... Fried onion requires... 47% onion. So like maybe right there. And if I eat it, if it's three star and I eat it, then I level it up even higher. Anytime has been a very busy month already for me, but i am been having lots of fun. That's good. Oh, dang it, it's two star. It's not good enough. Despicable. Uh, I have to eat it. Wait, will this level me? It probably won't, will it? Oops. Have to redo it? <laughs> it's like real life. It's like a pinch of salt. Oh, is that three star? Yeah, it is! Eat it! Darn it, it's so close to leveling. Shoot. Uh, how do I cancel the summon? There it is. Um... I guess I should use one. <laughs> it does 50 though, darn it. Should I not do that and get like a fifth? What is that? Fifth? Should I get a 15 one? Hi, Pooh. Thank you for the 88 months. How are you doing today? I just ate the food I made by accident. It's okay. You have to, what are you making? Ooh, <gasps> strawberry shortcake. <laughs> we made some chatters to follow Kylie around and play Zelda music in game. Zelda music would be nice. Do y'all not like my music that's playing right now? Is it too quiet? I like classic rock. Um. Hmm, I guess I'll just use this. 
because it says read pi story, but in order to get the pi story, you have to do this. Oh, actually, I don't know. Hold on, how do you get this? Pi story all about pies. Hold on, hold on, let me look it up. Maybe I don't have to do the cooking dungeon to get that book. What is this, rank seven? Nope, I have to get it from that butthole. Dang it. You're singing along? <laughs> I've been playing cyberpunk all after work today. Nice, Poot. How is it? Check the auction house. For... For what? Oh, this Zelda alert made you think about it? Yeah, I love Zelda. Um, the book. All about pies. Hmm. Mm, I don't see it. Chef Kylie, how's it going? It's good. Screw it. I'm just going to use one of these. Actually, I feel bad because it's only like a tiny bit. It's tiny. It's tiny. Uh. No, you're not, Effin. I really enjoy cyberpunk. It's very well made and engaging in the world city. So cool. I'm glad you're liking it. They did a lot of uh, work with it. <sighs> hmm. Should I buy one of these? That costs 50. Do they all cost 50? Wow, it costs a lot. <laughs> I'm gonna buy one. This is 15 training experience. Will that be enough to level my cooking? Let's see, it's at 74. I don't think that'll be enough. Game says I still am. Yeah, I crashed yesterday too, Fn. You just have to wait a little bit. Or at least, yeah, I just had to wait a little bit. The items are shared across the tabs. It just lets you use a different currency. Oh, okay. Screw it. I'm a great chef. I'm rank six cooking now. <gasps> Make a pie? <laughs> what? Oops, I didn't mean to drop that. Make a pie? Okay. Ow. How do I make a pie? Pie baking. What kind of pie should I make? An apple pie? How do you get this? Enter pan pie crust. How do I get it? Oh, here we go. Pan pie crust. Wheat flour. Oh, milk and an egg. Oh, I need milk. There's a Halloween pumpkin pie. Oh, there's that moon jumbo mooncake. Oh. Okay, I need to get some milk. I have some bottles. I have 12 bottles. Okay, let's go milk some cows. Uh, are there any cows in tier? I need some milk, yes. Do you have a cow pet? <laughs> I could go find some cows, but I don't know where a cow is. 
<laughs> Got milk? Go to a main. A main. Trading post? Like the. Where you do. Oh! There's cows here! Can you please let me have some milk? Thank you. Wait, am I getting milk? Oh, I got it. <laughs> Chrono, thank you for the three, stream streak. <laughs> Ooh, my milking is upgraded. <laughs> I've been meaning to like get my playlist up to date. So that you guys can enjoy music. Yikes, the cow moved. I think that's enough milk. I don't have to have that many. Rank eight milking, holy cow. Woohoo, okay. Let's make a pie. Pie crust. Where is it? Okay, so we got we flour, egg, and milk. Oh, I need a rolling pin cooking table. Okay. All right, 70%. Pan pie crust. Eat. Does this count as a pie that I made? Oh, it does. But it's just the crust. Hmm. Okay. I guess that's fine. <laughs> Alright, made that. Alright. Oh, and then I need more chocolate. What a very old song. This was early 1970s. I remember my dad used to listen to this song all the time. I like it. It's a classic. Chocolate. Okay. And there's so many steps with this. Jeez. <laughs> Queen is the best. I agree. Okay, that's done. No, it's not. I have to eat it now. Eat jam three star. I'll make pasta instead. What if I make this? I have water, not a lot, but I have some water. Rolling pin cooking table. 20%. Eighty, and then five. Is that five? <laughs> Making short pasta. Ooh. Oh, that was only four. Okay, let me do it again.
Do you have a a lighter in game? If so, you should wave it. <laughs> I don't think I have anything like that. <laughs> That would be cute though. Wait, actually, I think there's like, uh, like glow sticks. I think they have glow sticks in the game. Short puzzle created. Darn it, I still need to make some jam that's three star. Okay, let's try that again. I've just been doing chocolate. Okay. Would y'all like some of the chocolate that I'm making? <laughs> so much food. Okay, I'm gonna buy a lot of chocolate stuff. I'll buy five. This is where it gets a little tricky because I have to make three star exactly. Excuse me, Mr. Cow. Some recipes that are about 20 steps. Excuse me? Dang it, I made it too good. <laughs> Cooking with a food truck summoned gives you an experience buff. It does? Oh, that, oh, darn it, that's two star. Dang it, I made a four star and a two star. Give me a three star, darn it. Oh, wait, I think I messed that one up. <laughs> Give me three star. I like how they're all jumping. What the heck? There we go. That's three star. Nope, it's two star. <laughs> Okay, this is three star for sure. This is three star, I can feel it. Oh no, never mind. Dang it! <laughs> I was doing so good and now I'm not. Okay, hold on, I need to look at the recipe again. Okay, it says 42. And then 41. And then 20. Hmm. I guess I should pay attention to what pops up because obviously I'm doing something wrong. Less whipped cream than required. Oh my god, this one star. <laughs> Do I not have any more? I'm gonna sell my chocolate. My Oh, I'm eating my chocolate. Oh god. Oh well, I'll just eat it. Oh! What's happening? This is... What the? <laughs> what? <laughs> these cookie... These food cutscenes are freaking silly. What the heck? Did I level up my cooking yet? No, no, okay. <laughs> the heck? <laughs> All right, I might need to buy five more. Sugar and whipped cream. Oh, sorry, Rusty! Thank you so much for subbing! Welcome to my fairy family. We're so happy to have you. Thanks for using Prime on my channel. I have a feeling that Prime Gaming is gonna go away soon, guys. Just because Twitch announced that they're not profitable, which they're not. They haven't been profitable in a while, so I think it may have been news for a lot of people that didn't already know. But that's the reason why they sold it to Amazon. But, um, 
Yeah, but I'm, I have a feeling that they're going to get rid of Prime Gaming soon, so thank you for using your Prime Gaming, Rusty. I appreciate it. It's going to stink if they get rid of it, though. I will be really sad. A lot of my subs are Prime Gaming. Okay, there we go. That should be better. Ooh. Oh. Dang it, it's forced. <laughs> I can't win. I can't win. Lost leader, perhaps? Yeah. How do you get three star, guys? Oh no! <laughs> the chocolate's showing! <laughs> My character looks different. Come on, three star! Oh, <gasps> I made three star! I did it! Yeah! Woo! All right, now I gotta use another one of these. Level cooking. Woo, rank five, chef! Rank five! We did it. Did you see that, cows? Did you see that? My goodness. <laughs> wow. This food's going right to right right to my body. All right, make a steam dish, make a pie. Okay, let's see. What's a what do they mean steaming? Oh, steam dish. Okay. Rice. Ooh, holiday rice cake. Rice, water, and sugar. <gasps> Galbi stew. stew. <gasps> I usually just look at what I can just buy. <laughs> an eggplant? Oh, can I buy an eggplant from my shop? No. You can gain weight by drinking water? No! What? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, I can do this one. Egg casserole. I'm gonna make an egg casserole. Egg, water, salt. Okay, I need more water. This is cool. I'm getting water from my truck. <laughs> egg, water, and salt. I think I need to buy more salt though. Actually, I think one is enough. My upper body got bigger and my legs got bigger. <laughs> it's a water weight. <laughs> okay, let me just get all this water. There we go. Okay, let's make an egg casserole. Wow, leveling up skills, life skills is kind of fun. I like it. Egg casserole. All right, so I need 88, 88. How is it, how do you add 1% of salt? Oh, salt. Okay. 
There. Is that one person? That really is a pinch of salt. Less egg than required. Oh, three star. Not bad. Look at that. Looks kind of tasty. It's kind of tiny. So you can't really tell. Okay, let me make a pie now. What pie should I make? I have pie crust. Ooh, meat pie? Interesting. Ooh, what about an egg tart? No. Meat pie. Pecan pie? What's y'all's favorite pie? Sweet potato pie? Can I buy a sweet potato? Oh, there's pecans. Maybe I should buy a pecan. Make a pecan pie. I can make a meat pie. You really like pecan pie? Oh, well, coming right up for you, Lard. Coming right up. Pecan pie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Pumpkin pie? Mmm. Pumpkin pie with like vanilla ice cream or whipped cream. Rebirthing would be the quicker way. <laughs> what if I just run around like this? I like, I look, I look good with my angles. My angles? My curves. Sweet potato is an ingredient gathering item. Mm, okay. Yes, I'll make you a pie of love. There you go. Let's see how good my pie is. <sighs> three star pie! Not bad. Actually, that's perfect because I need to eat a three star pie. Look at my pie! It looks so good! I'm not. Oh man. I look different by the, by the minute. <laughs> Make jam. Okay, right. We need to make some more chocolate. Because chocolate is jam. Don't ask. Do I have to eat it? Thank God I don't have to eat it. Sorry, I ate your pumpkin pie. I needed to. <laughs> now I make three star chocolate like when I don't need it. All right, use. I'm rank four cooking. Woo! Now I'm not gonna be as lucky because. Oh, <gasps> pizza! Oh my God, Effin's gonna be so happy. Effin, I can make pizza. Hi, King Frodo! Diet potions. How do you get those? You can always go to hot springs. That's true. We can give some food to the monkeys. <laughs> do you want my pizza? What kind of... Do you want a chocolate pizza? <laughs> a calzone? Oh, man. These are so many pizza. Margarita pizza. That's my favorite. There's a deep dish pizza. Hold on, how do I make the plain pizza dough? Is it under... Um, how do you do this? Oh my god, pineapple pizza! They have pineapple pizza! <laughs> Alright, time to make some pizza. Is there an easier pizza to make though? Because it looks like I have to... How do you make this? Oh, here we go. I need flour dough. I need flour dough. Okay, so that's probably... Uh... Steaming, maybe? No. How do you make flour... Flour dough. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, it's kneading. Oh, wheat flour, yeast, and water. Okay. I need yeast. Where's the yeast? Did I miss it? Oh, here we go. <laughs> My inventory has so much random food. Hi, Will! I'm too late for the content. What do you mean the content? I'm... <laughs> I am. <laughs> I'm making y'all pizza while listening to classic rock. Man, making that wheat flour lasted a while. Okay, so I needed to make flour dough. Okay. So, 75. That doesn't look right. Hold on, let me redo that. Hmm. See, online it says something different. It says online you need to do 66. Maybe like that. And then 22% water. And then 14 <laughs> or 12 yeast. Hopefully that's good. You were be right back when I got here. Oh, yeah, I went to the bathroom. Okay, I made flour dough. So now, I can make pizza, I think. Um, I need to make plain pizza dough. Plain pizza dough. I'm wondering if there's a secret ingredient. No, there's not. This is 100%. Wow, that's easy. Does this count as making pizza? It does, doesn't it? Oh my god, it does! Four star? <laughs> that makes no sense! <laughs> what? Why didn't I make five star pizza dough? See, make a really delicious pizza. I feel... <laughs> Eat a delicious pizza, three star. Okay, I need to make a three star pizza. Um, mm, chocolate pizza with marshmallows. Mm, should I get thyme and oil? Oh wait, no, I need to make something that requires this. Maybe sweet potato pizza. Maybe this. This pizza. Gorgonzola. I need a block of cheese and garlic. I have garlic. I need a block of cheese. There we go. Y'all ready for some delicious pizza? Gar ga gorgonzola pizza. Mm. Hopefully that's three star. Happy Monday, one run. You having a good day? <gasps> it's three star. Yay. Oh, my eyes are hurting me. Eat. Woo! All right, I am 76%. Make a steam dish, make a pie. Let's see if I can do all of these and not have to get that book. Because if I have to get that book, uh, it's not going to be good. What did I make again? Oh, 
Oh, I made an egg casserole. Oh, I need salt. All right, steam egg casserole. Tiny bit of salt. Do you get experience boost from kitchen tools? So I use reforges on them. This one has intelligence. This one has cooking training experience. This one has nothing. This one has cooking training experience. So I tried. I was using the reforges I got to like try to put stuff on them. I think Critical said er earlier said that if she needs antique what's antique oh you can share some with me okay okay i'll need to make a pie i need to make a pie All right, 70. So you're saying that if I were to use an item that helps me with my experience, that this this bar would go up more? I'm at a main, uh, a main by the gate, by all the cows. I think I'm on channel, I'm on channel seven. Okay, let me mm, hold on. Let me put my stuff up real quick so I don't like confuse it with yours. Even though I don't think I would do that. I think that's it. Okay. Thank you. They are lower forges, but they'll help a little bit. Definitely better than what I had. Thank you. Okay, let me put the knife right here. <laughs> Careful with the knife. Hopefully it's enough. You don't need the book. Ugh, hope. Wait, actually. <laughs> no. I made too many. <laughs> the only thing left is that stupid book. No. And I don't have any more coins. Um, should I should I buy the thingy? <laughs> it is cat. Antique cooking equipment gives set bonus like training experience and qualities cooking quality. You can grind adventure seals or vouchers. I mean, I have some already, right? I have 149 second vouchers. I don't know how I'm getting these, but I have 149. Should I buy this thing? The skill training 15? I don't, oh, I think it would level me up to the next rank. Should I use it? Should I use it? Do I try? I can't afford any other ones though. Only in this one. I think if you're desperate. Yeah, I'm desperate. I don't want to do the cooking dungeon. Use cooking. Yeah! I'm a wise chef now. I wonder what the Grand Master cooking missions are like. There we go. Now I'm rank three! Woo! Make a really delicious ferment. Okay, you know what? Before I do that, I should stop being a dummy and let me rebirth. 
I'm gonna change to the cooking talent. <laughs> I know. Though I probably should have waited, because I'm probably gonna have to eat more food. <laughs> Wait, what level, what is that? 13? I like being 12. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cooking, choose, purchase, close. There we go. Level up. Oh my gosh, amazing. Okay. All right, let's continue. <laughs> let's see, what do I have to do now? Make a really delicious fermented dish. Four star higher. Fermented? Fermenting. What do you, what is ferment? Like, what do you, I need a fermentation vat? Do you have a fermentation vat? <laughs> what the heck is that? Buy an icy forbidden diet potion, 150k each. I don't need them now. I rebirthed. Um, oh, also, sorry, Lo, I didn't see that. If you want to make quick money today and don't mind spending, I think it's 18 adventure seals. Buy a stack of fine leather. I'll 100% buy it off of you at not the absurd price the market has it for. What is the <laughs> what is the price the market has it for? Uh, basically antique oh wait I read that uh, it gives you 15 experience so it'll level you Calculate how many points you can get while you are wearing the cooking gear. How do I do that? <laughs> 2 point 1.20 times training experience boost 1.20 times That's for this Peppermint coffee that's Sounds really good. Multiply and add. I don't wanna. <laughs> but I don't even, I need to make fermentation. Or I need to ferment some stuff. Hold on, do you sell the fermentation back? There it is. I needed this. Okay, can I reforge this? Should I use my reforge on my this thing? <laughs> to see if my, can I get that? Cooking experience? Will it count? Fine leather is 63k each. I mean, I need money. I want to buy this really pretty dress. I want to get this really pretty dress. Let me show y'all. It's so cute. I want this one. But I don't want to buy it right now because that means I only have 7k left. <laughs> Look how cute! I like it. I'm gonna change my outfit. I'm gonna change my shoes and my... I'm gonna not change my colors. I'm still gonna do these colors, but I was just gonna change it. Am I planning on getting to rank one cooking right now? Uh, I was just doing it for fun. So if I get to rank one cooking, then yeah! But... Uh, if not, then I, I don't know. I guess not. Hmm. If so, you can come to my homestead. I'll give you another little boost. Okay. In your head. What it? Oh. What? Oh, Lulu, you already got the king cake. 
Oh, I'm jealous. That sounds really good. Is there something I have to do to get this bonus? There's this in-game mechanic where you get, you can get experience boost. Wait, I also have this. Maybe I should be using this. Oh, maybe I shouldn't do this. I have this complete skill experience potion. And I also have this one too. But when I click on it, it says, it says the skills below may not receive the training experience bonus effect. And it says cooking. I'm a little confused. Is it combat? It says complete skill EXP. You can get a life one from the event shop. It's three times. It's because you're already capped. Oh, okay. Um, do I just cook in here? What do I do? Do I have to like use something? Ooh, that's pretty. Ooh. I like your grass. Can I cook in your grass? It's because it adds at times eight. Okay. Click on the house. Is this your house? Enter. You can go inside people's houses? Oh my god, and it has rooms? Oh, cool. <laughs> what? I didn't know this. That there's the house elves that boost your experience. Oh my god, she's just chopping up a little potato. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, this is cute. <laughs> it's a big house, it is. You have to turn it on? Okay. Oh my god. Wait, so we can decorate our house? Like, inside our house? Did you put these barrels here? Is the person with a food truck in the homestead? I have a food truck. I got it. I got it today. I'll turn on our experience boost for cooking so if anyone else wants to come feel free ah oh. thank you heck yeah okay i need to figure out what to do um i have my fermentation should i use these reforges on the fermentation vat or should i not because I can't firm it, or I don't have, um, I guess, max experience because, or whatever y'all were saying, because this, this has the cookie experience, this doesn't. I should be fine? Oh, okay. I won't worry about it then. Alright, let's see what I have to make. I have to firm it something. Ooh, kimchi! Napa cabbage, salt, red pepper powder. Let's see. This thing is obnoxious. Can I like make it? I guess this is fine. Stay. Okay. All right. Does they do they sell the cabbage? Oh, perfect cabbage. I'm gonna make some kimchi, guys. Red pepper powder. What was the other one? Red pepper powder. Cabbage. What was the other one? Was it salt? I think it was salt. What does this thing look like? It's like a jar? Do I have to stand by the house, elf? Thanks, Orca! 
I used the tailoring one last night to finish Danning. Mmm. My coworker loves kimchi. I love kimchi. Oh, they have natto. I don't like natto, though. I tried it. I can't. The texture is too... I can't. <laughs> it's not bad, but I just... It, it's just not for me. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I made good kimchi. I made three star kimchi. Oh. I guess I need that. Cool. There it is. Oh, but I need to make four star. Hmm. Okay, let's try again. I can't remember what it told me I needed to do. Let's try this. <laughs> oh no, more Napa than required. I made too much. That's two star, it's not good. It really is gonna be low. Cause there's this, there's this, uh, dress I really want. It's 25 million on the auction house, but I really want it. And then I want, I need to figure out what shoes I want and a new hat. <laughs> so all my gold is going to go away. <laughs> so by the time we have another event, it's going to be like, oh, you get some three star chocolate from Kylie. Yay. <laughs> it's what you always wanted. Oh. How about that? Let's see. 30. Okay, I think like that. Maybe that will be four star. I think I need to add more cabbage. Oh, more salt, actually. <gasps> That's four star! I made four star kimchi! Now I have to eat a three star kimchi. Did I make a three star? Oh, I did. Perfect. <gasps> wow, that leveled me right up to rank two. Woohoo! Make a really delicious so what? What is that? I'm gonna move this over here. Okay. Suvide? Suvide? What the heck? I need a souvenir immersion tub. Got it. <laughs> wow, having this truck is so nice. <laughs> uh, I don't. I've never heard of this. Um, what do you do? Sam chicken breast salad. Dang, what should I make? Soy sauce? Do I, can I buy soy sauce? No. Um. Let's see. Is there anything I can just buy? Oh, here we go. Butter, pepper, and meat. Can I buy butter? Oh, there it is. Butter, pepper, and meat. Hmm. 
Thanks, Tang. When five star, five star has been made. Oh, but I used it. <laughs> it was pizza, pizza dough. I made five star pizza dough. Oh no, pasta dough. Nah, you're fine, Sarai. It's okay. I got it like only a couple hours ago, so it was a gift. Kylie should suffer just a little bit. Suffering? <laughs> what? Here we go. 85. This is 70. 80. 6%. Nice. <laughs> what am I doing? What is that? Large meat, less meat than required. Oh, I made three star. Ah, I need to make four star though. All right, do it again, but do it better this time. Here we go. <laughs> I see the boost in our chat logs. Oh, you see it? Oh, the this boost? Dang it, that's two star. Hmm. I need to I need to use these shadow thingies today. I wanna do this on hard. It's 3 p.m. Hmm. She'll suffer plenty in mid-game plus. Why why must I suffer at all? Don't let me suffer chat. Hopefully that's good. No, I think I need to redo that. I wish there was a better way of calculating. I've been doing like this one's 30, 60 with this, all of this. This is like 70. So you go 30 and this is five. 30 and this is five. So that's 70, 80, 85. 60 is like, I guess to the D or 6% to the D. And then this is nine. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh man, less meat than required. So I need more meat. Darn it. Okay, more meat it is. Maybe like that then? I did it! I did it! I made a four star dish! Woo! Look at that, handmade sirloin ham. And then I need to eat a three star. Where's my three star? Perfect, eat. Yum. Oh! Oh my god, I'm rank one cooking! <laughs> I did it! Should I finish this? Oh my god. What's a Juleen dish? What is that? Hold chat. Hold Juleening. It's all fish. Oh wait, I have that. Wait, I have this, but I have that. Okay, hold on. What about this one? What is yo? Oh, plain yogurt. What is that? This is cool. By the time she gets to the late mid, chat will steer her into the right direction to become a mage. Pallid. That was the enchant I was asking about yesterday when we were talking about enchants. Pallid. That's like the one, one of the most expensive ones. Wait, what's a long cooking knife? Oh, I need a long cooking knife. Ah, long cooking knife. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Oh, it's like sushi knife. Um, 
A burrito? This is Korean beef tartar. I had this when I was in South Korea. It was good. Um, Korean beef tartar. Okay, it's just large meat and an egg. How many more eggs? I have lots of eggs. Perfect. It's a way of chopping chopping stuff. A billion? Is is that where you is that what you find from Crom? Crom blah blah. Crom crotch. Whoa, look it. I'm a master chef. Holy cow. Oh, immediately four star. Oh my god, I'm a master chef. Oh, I'm a master chef. We did it. I didn't have to do all of this, I guess. Woo, ring one cooking. That was fun. <laughs> Uh, Yin, where can I give you, where, where are you so I can give you your stuff feedback? Here you go. Okay. Thanks for letting me borrow all of your cooking utensils. And your, and your little house elf. Thank you! Yay! Now I have all this food. <laughs> Orca, Effin, do you want to work on Grandmaster now? Perfect. Let's do it. Do y'all want to do the four star one first? Or, f oh, sorry, four player one first? I like the house thing. Now I want to go in everybody's homesteads and look in their houses and see how you, how you can decorate houses. Because that's cool. I've only seen like the outside of homesteads. Ooh, diet potions. What is this? Oh. I probably need this diet potion. Use. I took a diet potion. Does it work immediately? <laughs> Alright, we need one more person to come help us with Grandmaster Missions if you guys aren't doing anything and would like to come. Uh, the mission I'm referring to is this one. Talk to Lazaro to complete a shadow mission for player. Both me and Effin have that. Oh, this is too slow. I can help. Okay. Meet us in front of the castle. Does it count for yourself if you have it as well? Or is it individual? Oh, actually, I'd, I assumed it counts for both of us, but does it not count for both of us? <laughs> I could be wrong. A uh, grandmaster. I gotta sneeze. Uh. Uh. Wait. We need. Gotta get F in here. Yeah, F in needs to come. Oh, it does count for both. Okay. Perfect. Don't worry. We're gonna do Red Dragon after this. If y'all wanna also do Red Dragon, 
I got a hard one. I want to do the hard one. And then me and Effin both. Wait, actually, I take that back. Orca, Effin, anybody? Do 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 you need any any red dragon? I need one, but I'm asking because I have three more passes. I don't know what this is. Secret experiment. I don't need red dragon. I don't need it today. I need the Albin mission. Okay, I don't know what that is, but okay. All right, let's go in. Yes, please. My body got slimmer. Oh no, I'm too skinny now. Oh no. <laughs> uh oh, it did warn me. Oh wait, I need to talk to this guy. Sorry. If you guys want to run it back after this one, let me know. Oh, yeah, we can help you low if you... Yeah, 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 yeah. You need it, right? Oh, God. Oh, I love it. My legs are twigs. I know. <laughs> Look how tiny. I thought I would need it because I was eating so much food, but I guess not. <laughs> God. Yay, thank you. It did count? Okay, good. Woohoo! I might, I might actually finish getting Grandmaster. No, no, I won't. I think I'll have like one, one more. All right, we need to help uh low are you here low <laughs> thank you for helping uh bloodlust cheese wheels are good for bulking up the legs darn it i thought i thought i needed it but i didn't What do you gotta do now? Um, Lo is coming. We're gonna help him with his four uh, player mission. And then uh, Red Dragon. And then how do we get the Alvin one, Orca? Because the other thing I have to do is just kill a hundred zombies, but. <laughs> Chai! <laughs> Also, wait. Oh, hi, Gift World. How are you doing today? Sorry. Warden of the Gods. Avon. A Avon. Avon Champion Hard. Hi, Vesu. I can carry other, but we need passes. I have three. Oh, wait, you're talking about the other passes. Never mind. There is a bot army in Rundle, and I'm scared. Wait, what? A bot army? How many bots are there? Can, uh, uh oh, Orca FN, can you, can you leave so we can let Lo join? You took a screenshot? Oh, is the music getting weird? Okay, hold on, let me fix it. Oops, hold on. Oop. One second. Oops, sorry, that's really loud. All 
Alright, is that better? <laughs> Did it sound care scary? Sometimes it does that. Alright, do we have... Uh, oh, we need one more person. Can one more person join? Please. Good now? Good. I need to check to see if they give me red dragon today. Yeah, definitely check. Okay. Oh, maybe I should give you the leader. There you go. It was startling for a moment. <laughs> Sorry. Because the audio splitting thing is new on OBS. So sometimes it it sounds kind of crunchy, and I have to I have to fix it when it does that. But I can't hear it on my side, which is the problem. Oh my god! What is what? Who is that? He's the hot spring spirit. What? There's a hot spring spirit. <laughs> what is that? Uh oh. I don't do very much damage with this. Who cares? Oh god. Anyways, but um, only you guys can hear when it goes crunchy, but not not me. So y'all, I, I kind of rely on you guys to let me know if my audio messes up until, you know, until um, uh, OBS fixes it. <laughs> so it doesn't do it, uh, do it anymore. Oh, a zombie. I have to kill zombies. I have to kill a hundred, but I'll probably do the that um other quest where it'll like be super fast. Oh, sweet potato! I needed that earlier. I'm so happy I got rank one cooking. Whoa! Big lion! Yay, we did it! Okay. All right, I'm gonna ask the people that need red dragon to enter first. Yeah, I'm gonna quit the party and then... Red dragon. All right. So if you need red dragon, oh, we're doing Avon real quick. Oh, okay. Oh, they're going to do Avon. Okay. Well, I guess I can still create a party. Anyways, if you need to, oh, if you need red dragon enter, I don't know if anybody here needs it, but let me know if you do. Um, and if you would like to go, you can enter as well. Which Avon is it? Um, Orca needed. Oh, KXV needed Red Dragon. Okay. Um, Champion Hard? They needed to do Champion Hard. Okay. Warden was FN's. Yeah, FN, war, FN needed Warden of the Gods, I think. I can't remember. Yeah, he did. Um, while we wait for them to come back, because I want them to come with, can you show me this, the, the army? Show me the army, Lo. I want to see the army. Where, did he, where do I have to go to to see the army? Or are they gone? They're probably there. I'll take you. Okay. Here, join my party. You need red dragon? Okay, here you go. Why did they skip the song?
Whoa, what is that? <laughs> That's a mighty big sword you have there. To Rundle. Do I try to get on your mount? Rundle is just a dungeon, right? Green dragon! Oh, it's one seat? Oh, okay. Where's Rundle? Oh, you want me to ride this guy? Ooh. <laughs> Hold on, can we just use the dungeon guide? Is it Rundle here? Yeah, right there. Yeah, here we go. Rundle. Oh, we'll be right back. We're just gonna check. We're just gonna check this. Oh my god! <laughs> it's kind of scary looking. They're all just standing there with fishing poles. <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> Hello, army, uh, 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 clone army. <laughs> Are they going to talk? Is this the Clone Wars? Mabinogi Clone Wars. Dang it. <laughs> Alright, well. <laughs> it looks funny. Okay, let's go to... Um, Tara. I'm gonna need somebody to get the Red Dragon mission because I can't get it yet. Obviously, we're not gonna go in yet. Um, because we still, we need people to come here. So, Empress needs Red Dragon. KXV needs it. I need it. And that's perfect, because I have three, I have three, um, uh, tickets. I have three tickets. <laughs> XPS. Mm hmm Just be patient for a little bit longer. Oh, Orca, you're back. Uh... Dudu, can you do me a favor and go get the mission again for us? Let's do hard first. I don't need, so I can hop off if anyone else needs. Okay. Well, just wait, Orca, because I don't know if we have a full full party yet. Thank you, Dudu. Just here for free loot. <laughs> okay. It's good. Okay, I'm going to ask everybody, please let me kill the red dragon first. So I get it, and then we'll do, um, KXV, and then the last one will be Empress Raven. Does that, does that work with everyone? All good? Did everybody that want to join, join? Give me leader. Right, right, right. Hold on. It should count as a party kill, no. Unfortunately, no. It, it's last hit, unfortunately. Does anyone else need it? I think we're good. I know. It stinks. I know. Hold on, don't go yet. Oh wait, you can't go anyway. <laughs> this dude is not even here yet. <laughs> so... You understand how, how we do a doo-doo. At the very end, just change the red dragon to uh, all finish. But at the beginning, you don't need to. Yeah. We'll change the finish rule at the end, but let me, let me actually kill it. 
But y'all are probably going to need to fight the red dragon because it's going to be... This is a hard dungeon. So I feel like I'm not going to be able to do that much damage to it. You... I can solo it? You think so? I mean, I can try. <laughs> I feel... I feel really weak, but I can try. I feel like on advance and int I can do it, but on I don't know on hard. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. I think it's better safe than sorry to make it be finished rule anyways. Look at FN doing magic! Wow, FN! Magic man. If you finish generations, you get plus a thousand levels. Well, that's gonna be TBD. <laughs> I think what I'll try to do is do generations, a little little bit of generations every day. A little bit. I don't plan to like beat a generation every day. Like I think that's a little too much for me. And that's a good way for me to burn out. So what I'll probably do, kind of like what I did today, like I finished Gen G G1 today. I only had like three left, so it was pretty quick, pretty quick. Tomorrow I'll probably start um, G2, but I don't plan on finishing it. We'll just do a little bit and then I'll stop. And then the following stream, do a little bit and stop. Yeah. He's fireballing. He is fireballing. <laughs> How was the end of G1? I, I, it was good. It was good. It was good. Everybody has like their own room. <laughs> I'm coming up in. I like that Morgana wasn't evil. Um, Chichol. Chichol was the one behind everything. And I feel kind of bad for Moors. He literally lost his wife and daughter, and then he was tricked. And poor guy died saving us. Like, it's kind of messed up, man. But though technically, I mean, technically, his, you know, child is still kind of alive. More, however you say her name. I'm not... <laughs> You have come to the wrong stream if you want proper pro pronunciations. <laughs> um. With or without you. Where am I? I'm lost. Oh, this way? Oh, we have to get the... Make sure to get the secret pass. You have to open the chest. Oh, somebody already got it. Okay. All right, time to go into the closet. Yeah, the baby crying scene is messed up. An hour or two, maybe? Wait, what's an hour or two? Chichol was cosplaying as Mor Mor Morgan, or Morgan, whatever you say, all along. Yeah, she was, or he, he was. And then we fought Glass Blue Behyman, which more terrifying than he, he was more bark than bite. <laughs> but that's just probably because I'm pretty high level, so. But still freaky looking. He was ter he was creepy. He was creepy. And then like the roaring it makes. Mm. Nah, I don't like it. Not a fan. And he was gigantic. But now the form former war or whatever, the Chichol guys amassing his army 
All right, here we go. Do y'all mean to try to kill the dragon myself? Can you change it to the... Can you change the party thing just in case? Do do. Unless you already changed it. Oh, you did change it. I just didn't see it. My bad. See, I don't do that much damage. Oh, oh god. Yeah, I don't do that much damage. Is it because I'm a ranger? Hmm. Just make sure not, don't finish it, guys. Let me finish it. There. I got it. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna do this again. So, don't worry. <laughs> I wish it counts. Could count for everybody, though. You don't have that many stats to spot your level. Your stats damage low. That's why I can't get it. Got it. I'm darn it, Mr. Dragon. <laughs> yep. You got a hat. <laughs> Ooh, there's a suit. Ooh, why is nobody picking up this stuff? Ooh, I want this too. I need a lot more decks. I mean, next, after, I mean, I wanted to level up cooking just because, why not? Um, here, Doo, Doo let me give you another one. Uh, now I'm going to work on tailoring. That's going to be my next task, is tailoring. Okay, this is an advanced mission. Here you go. Look at this. This looks cool. Look at it. And it match. Look at the colors. I They both dropped at the same time. They're both purple. Look, I have a whole outfit for someone. Orca, can you wear this? Oh, you can. Orca, put this outfit on. <laughs> I want to see what it looks like. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Swag. <laughs> Fashion. Fashionogi. Do the clothing part time job for tailoring. Okay. You know what? I was supposed to do the Glennis part time job, but I never did it. I needed to do it, but it's okay. Do I want easy mode tailoring or the classic Mabby experience? Easy mode. <laughs> I guess. I don't know. I'll join. I never did it. Okay. I don't have... I'm not leader right now. Um, but... Oh, there you go. Dude is the leader. Yay! Alright, so this kill will be... Oh. Oh wait, KX did you, what, KX did you need the kill? I'm confused. Oh, did I, did I, did I misunderstand? Sorry. Okay. All right. Uh, Empress Raven needed the kill though. So let's let Empress Raven kill it. I'm ready. Are you sure, KX? You, I have, I have another pass too. It's either that or it'll expire. So, wait one second. I picked the wrong one. Oh, okay. Saga's one is more fun. Okay, gotcha. All good.
What is the Yin, what is easy mode tailoring versus classic mode tailoring? What is the difference? <laughs> what is the difference? Is it like is Is it like uh doing the part-time job? Am I tailoring today? No, I'm not going to do it today. I will do it in the future, but not today. Cooking was my idea, or was my goal today. I wanted to get to rank one cooking. Well, to be honest, I just wanted to rank up cooking. I didn't know if I'd get to rank one because of all the cooking dungeon stuff. I learned, I learned cooking dungeons. Hold on, let me... Um, I learned, I just wanted to learn what Cooking Dungeons were, was, and it's not bad. It's not the worst, but I, I think, I think I would have liked, I would like it more if you could go with, like, at least one other person. Um, why am I not fighting? Sorry. <laughs> oh, probably, that's probably why. Oh, oh, metal opening. Oh, here we go. Never mind. <laughs> Dang it, every single time. <laughs> but yeah, Cooking Dungeon would be a lot more fun with, like, people. I would like to do it with people. Uh, and then somebody said it's like a good way to make money, so maybe like I could do that. Like when I'm not doing anything, <laughs> just because it's fun. Like the idea of like getting a certain amount and you know watching. Ta I think it's kind of cool. It's like a unique dungeon experience. Oh, here we go. Secret puzzle cleared. Oh, I think I'm hitting all the wrong ones. my frame with a dent. No. That stinks. I'm sorry. Can you can you send it back and say like, hey, it has a dent on it. I, you know, want a new one. Because that's like t normal. <laughs> it's a normal thing to do. Re I recently got something off Amazon and they did the, the one thing I hate the most, and that's when they deliver the item to the wrong address. <laughs> but, and then you see it, it was like my neighbor had it. <laughs> I hate it so much when they do that, because it stresses me out to high heaven. Like, I get so stressed out when they deliver it to the wrong place. Oh, are y'all already in here? But I, I get I get really stressed out and you're like, just go to the front door and and you know tell them that it's the wrong delivery. Guys, I have like social anxiety. I can't just go and do it. I hated it. And then they had a ring doorbell and I was like, I couldn't just take it because they had a ring doorbell and I didn't want them to think I was stealing it, but it's mine. So my mom was like, just ring the doorbell. And I was like, I hate doing that. <laughs> but I did, and nobody answered. So I just awkwardly said what happened to the door, assuming that they were listening somehow. <laughs> oh, make sure to change the party rule, if unless it's already changed. No, you're good. It's already good. You're good to go, Empress, if you want to solo it. If you need help, let me know. 
But yeah, I just, I don't know. I just, I don't know. I made it probably a bigger deal than it needed to be, but I didn't enjoy the fact that they did that. <laughs> <laughs> actually gave me a new desk for free because of shipping oh really yeah and then you have to talk to people which I don't necessarily mind but I don't know I don't know it's just some people are scary <laughs> and I have no idea who they are yay good job did you get it did you get the kill Yay! You're welcome! Perfect. <sighs> I was wanting to get my 1,000 piece puzzle going this weekend. Dang it! And it's bent. I'm sorry. Oh look! There's the Mary Jane shoes again, Effin! <laughs> Nice. Okay, let me go turn in this quest. Is there any other things y'all need help with in terms of Grandmaster things? I'm gonna go turn this in. They probably knew I played Mavi. <laughs> no. <laughs> but I felt so awkward just going to the front door and be like, hey. Amazon delivered this to the wrong place. Uh, this is mine. I'm gonna take it now. <laughs> and what's so funny is that it was it was a it was my walking pad, so it was really heavy. So like I had to like drag it. <laughs> Ugh, the worst. The worst. Look at that. <gasps> I have eight now. Woo! Now I just gotta kill some zombies. Let me go kill some zombies real quick. I'll be right back. Let me go do this thingy. Assuming I can. Thanks guys for helping me kill Red Dragon. And do the Red Dragon mission. Yin, thank you again for giving me those passes. Okay, let's see. Mm, how do I do this again? This one. Nowhere to run? Basic. Except. I just need to kill a hundred, a thousand, or a hundred, not a thousand. Does this count? Wait, maybe this doesn't count. Oh, I think it counts. Let me try again. Oh, it does count. Stop killing them. Woo! This is like the easiest thing ever. <laughs> it's good experience. I, is it good experience even for like uh, what, what, am, what am I doing? Basic. Ah! They drop gems too. And letters? What's that? Get some of their mail and force exchange? <laughs> no. They didn't answer the door anyways. Delivery my... F uh, the US was delivered my first ever belt PC to a neighbor once. Oh god, it's a bear. I hate the bear. What the heck? Uh, it was all part, it was all parts delivered. Funny enough, my neighbor didn't say anything until like a week later because they were away. So Newegg sent me all the parts again. <gasps> what did you do with the extra, like, did he give it back? So now you had like two PCs? 
Or did you like sell? What did you do? That's too loud. I ordered another case and gave it to my partner at the time as a birthday present. Aww. That's nice. You know what? I should probably be leveling up a shot. Seven is six out of a hundred. Should probably have my pets out. Collect the gold. Eighty-eight. How is she hitting me from all the way over there? All right, two more. One, two. All right, I'm just gonna leave now. Oh God, the bear. Get out of here, bear. There you go. What is this letter? Also, what is this? What is the letter I get? I thought I got a letter. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, I need to leave this place. Mm, exit. Woohoo! I did all my Grandmaster missions. Complete, continue. So wait, does that mean I can get another one? Oh my God, I can. Oh, look, I have the chef one. <sighs> Defeat. No! No! I hate this one. <laughs> I might skip this one. Because this one is a pain in the butt. Yeah, right? Not that one again. I know, I hate it. We were, I, I was, I had help. So basically there's like five ogres in the, was it the Bari dungeon? But you could also attack the ogres that are like in the field, but there's only one that shows up per channel. <laughs> it's the worst. And I have to kill 30 of them. <laughs> how could you? Wait, how could I what? What did I do? Why does, why does that keep skipping? Oh. How about Avon mission with the skeleton ogre? What's, what's that? I didn't hear about that. How many, does that count? I mean, if it's an ogre, it might count. How do I get that Avon mission? Guardian of Avon, any difficulty? Maybe. I mean, it doesn't hurt to try, does it? Oh, sorry, Jai. I just didn't know if it was too loud. Because now, now that I have different audio, I can't, I can't tell what's too loud for you guys and what's too quiet. Turned it up, if that makes you feel better. <laughs> Are y'all liking the music? I didn't know you guys would like classic rock. I love it. Though, I haven't really heard too much of the Eagles. I really like listening to the Eagles. Try it. Okay, I will, but how do I get the... You can buy it from the NPC in Avon. Can you take me to Avon, please? I can't go to Avon yet. Too late now. <laughs> 
I'll play, how about I play more next stream and then I'll just like blast it when it comes on. <laughs> I still really want to see that sword that's that y'all were talking about. I'm sad I haven't seen it yet. I'm still not there. Darn it. Okay, this NPC? Marlo. Guardian of Avon. Should I do advance? It's 15k gold. Okay, I bought an advanced one. I would buy a few. They are in the beginning. Oh wait, should I not have done, should I have not done advanced? Yeah, bloodless. Everybody was talking about it and it made me be like, oh, interesting. There, I bought three. It's fine, okay. All right. Let's go kill some ogres. I've had it in my bank since it came out. What, the sword? Don't have the gloves to hold it though. Someone let me borrow. Oh, you have to have the gloves to hold it, not just to pull it out. Did it count? Does it count? It counts! Yeah! It counts! Awesome. Oh, I had a question, guys. So I want to do another event for Valentine's Day. Um, I most likely will not have a 43 million item for a prize, but... <laughs> um... What would be fun to you guys, even if a prize is not, like, good? <laughs> My five-star food, no! Would y'all have fun with, like, a fashion show, like a Valentine's-themed fashion show? Obviously, not me. It would be, like, you guys would come with your your outfit on and we would do a little fashion show for fun no judges just a fashion show i mean we could but i mean i guess i could still get like something but i don't know know what commerce race but for valentine's day how does that theme judges for the commentary that would be cute it's better to not do such high value items, in my opinion. Oh, why is that? All backpacks, no boost. First one to Philia, let's go. The other idea was like a Valentine's themed um, scavenger hunt. Would that be fun? The amazing race. Like, my idea was doing, like, a scavenger hunt where, um, I'd have, I would need volunteers, but we would have, um, people dressed up in, like, their little Valentine's-themed outfit, and, like, let's just assume it's, just let's assume for right now it's me effing Orca. So you would first come to me, and I would trade you a scroll, and the scroll would have a riddle. And then the riddle would um, take you to FN. You had to go find FN in this riddle place, right? Um, and then you'd have to do something to interact with FN before he gave you the scroll. Like say it, like say the scroll required you to dance in front of him uh, or something. I don't know. Um, and then he would trade you the scroll to then you would have then it would tell you like how to find Orca and then you would go to Orca and then do something with Orca and then and then it would tell you to go back to me and in which case you would then get 
a prize. <laughs> My four star chocolate. <laughs> but I don't know, would that be kind of fun? I don't know. I don't know if people would find that fun or annoying. Where's the part where we find love? <laughs> I don't know. I'm thinking about it. I need to get better at cooking than if it's gonna be five star chocolate. Ah. He died! I did it! So how many ogres? That was 21 ogres! Hard monster horn. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Alright, I can do it again now. Okay, if y'all get the ogre one, definitely go to Avon. Speed dating. Oh my god! <laughs> <clears throat> I wish I could do something super unique like that, but I don't know. <sighs> would that would that be fun? Nobody answered, so I'm guessing maybe not. <laughs> I can keep thinking about I Valentine's ideas. Just fun little Valentine's idea ideas. People would make it weird, probably. It would kind of be funny to, it would be like a scavenger hunt, like find somebody random and uh, get them to dance with you and then take a screenshot. That would be really hard, but <laughs> you know what I mean? Like get them to dance with you randomly without saying anything and then, but it's hard to prove <laughs> unless unless you guys give me a list of things i have to do like a scavenger hunt for me but that's not really an event for you guys so hmm. I love the scavenger hunt. Thanks, Kat. Scavenger hunts are always fun. Have y'all done scavenger hunts before? For rewards, others tend to just do gacha pulls for rewards to give out. Oh, so like what I did for Christmas? Cause I literally thought that I was lame for doing that. <laughs> I thought that was lame of me because I, cause you couldn't open it. Ooh, look at that. That was good. Like, I didn't know if people actually enjoyed having the gotcha prizes. Um, items like the Abyssal Orb are just difficult to farm in quantity and would likely need to be bought from the auction house to supply. Gotcha. Yeah, it's... I mean, it was like a... It was like a one-time... Hey, that was really nice of Dreams to provide... But yeah, I don't, I would never be able to apply, um, do something like that, at least for a while, <laughs> you know. Sounds like Doki Doki Island. What sounds like Doki Doki Island? What, the speed dating thing? Old Paladin Generation Quest was a scavenger hunt. What is that? Yeah, I know. That was really nice of Dreams to provide that. Probably several hours. Probably a whole month or longer. I don't know. Seemed really rare, though. Go get the gold! What are y'all doing? Get it. Get it. Get it. Stop being lazy. Oh! I hear I'm excited for CalCon. <laughs> yeah. I was I I didn't even know it was a thing and I mean granted I'm new. I'm new to stream. 
but uh, new to stream. I'm new to Mavnogi, so I didn't know until stream said something. But yeah, I want to be a part of CalCon. <laughs> I watched a streamer spin. Oh, are you talking about Peach Pia? Ow. We raided them yesterday. Um. That makes me sad that he never got it. Ooh, a wanted alert for horrifying Herbert. Orca! How much is, how much do cost is it? 86K. <laughs> Ooh, a ruby and a combo card. Yoink. Woohoo! I think that was 100 ogres. Or 30, not 100, 30. Yay, I did it! Okay, I need to go back to the castle and turn this in. Oh, I'm in combat. Hi, Bori! Oh my god, I like your cat emote! <laughs> I think it was a little inconvenient, but sometimes I push for interaction between people, which was nice. Wait, uh, what, what are you talking about, Lo? Are you talking about the, um, what, ideals? I don't know what that is. Ideals from the old Generation 2 quest. What did it have you do? Did you have to interact with people? Kind of like the Tara Bank part-time job? Because I love that stuff so much. Why can't I? Oh. Woohoo! I did it! I have 10! <gasps> Wait! I have 10! Y'all ready for this? Look! And I, I also have the... This thing. Watch, watch, watch! Watch at the top! Watch, watch, watch. Become a grandmaster. Continue. It didn't show up. Do I have to do it again? Never mind. Yay! It didn't pop up at the top. <laughs> oh, it's only for the first one? No! It's only for the first one in the 20th? <laughs> no. That sucks. Well, I got it. I now have two grandmasters under my belt. And I needed to do it for this thing, I think. Oh. Oh, it's three, not two. Never mind. Darn it. Never mind. Y'all didn't. Well, at least you saw it on stream. <laughs> I can't wait for Kylie to get to the generation quest in the castle. Do you remember what generation that is? Because I'm going to be doing generation two tomorrow. Oh my god. Really, Rain? So they had to have a certain look, closer, title? Whoa, that sounds difficult. I just thought of a cute, fun little idea we can do on stream. But I don't know if y'all would have find would y'all find it fun. Uh did Kylie make the Mabby only dis No, I'm going to do that. So, a lot of the people have been requesting to make um, a guild. I was going to make a guild discord. Um, obviously, everybody would be welcome to it, but I was wanting to make a guild discord. I have a Mabinogi text channel I use in my discord. Um, obviously, that's open to everybody, too. 
Um, but I was also going to make a uh, guild one. Because there's a lot of people in the guild that aren't a part of my stream. And I feel like that would be a good place to commune. Announcement or it didn't happen. No. Hi, Din. 18 more to go. <laughs> uh, now you just pair NPCs with NPCs. People would advertise they were ideals and sell the service. <laughs> wow. Yes, please let us glitchy guildless players join so we can chat. Okay. Sounds good. I can do that. Give me a little bit though to make it. It'll probably be called pixelated. It'll just be like my guild's name. But, but yeah. All right. Oh, before I log. Oh yeah, guild list. Yeah, if you ever want to join our guild, you're more than welcome to join. Um, if you guys see a premium summer newbie wear that is under 25 mil, can y'all? Oh. Well, it was it was on here for 25 mil, but this is what it looks like. If y'all see this, can you please let me know? I want to. I want to. <laughs> I don't. There's nothing wrong with the Discord we already have, to be honest. Yeah, but it's just because there's some people that are in my Mabinogi Guild that um, kind of want more channels specifically for like the guild and for Mabinogi so I was like okay I'll make one I might not be able to moderate both though so I'll probably need help with the other discord just because having my own discord it's enough <laughs> it's already a lot <laughs> so I might ask like Orca and Effin to help me out if they want but thank you guys for hanging out with me today we finished generation one. I got rank one cooking. And I also got my second grandmaster today. <laughs> that was a lot. I actually did a lot today. I don't want this mission. Y'all can have it. Thank you for the stream. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for keeping me company and talking and playing with me in the game. Thank you for helping me with the missions earlier and helping me with cooking. R1 cooking is nuts. Yeah, I went from what, rank eight to rank one today. <laughs> we did a lot of cooking. I learned about cooking dungeons. That was, that was new.